kissing now. You won't kiss me now. Do I sound as fat as I feel? Yeah, you, you're like you're <laughs> jutting on, you're out your you... stomach. You're eating pizza. <laughs> you said that with pizza in your mouth. This is a cinnamon stick. That's crazy. <laughs> That's. What's you, the last time you, you had one of you those? You look like that. Uh, Aiden looks like Jim Carrey in Dumb and Dumber right now with his you haircut. You look so... You, you, oh, I I'm, I'm coming dude, for you. Don't, I, don't you start barking up. You look like Wayne Rooney right now. <laughs> you do Who's look that? like Wayne Rooney. Look, that? look it up later, bro. You, you Who's that? Work. Yeah. Damn, we lost the UK. Oh, my God. Yeah, I look like a footy hooligan. This is a look. I, this is a shirt Miles gave me. I'm with it. Yeah. I look like I'm, I just came out of the pub or I'm going into the pub. I don't got stains on my shirt. You're, you're going to the pub. I'm playing like pubs. You came out of civil court divorce. What? I, yeah, they don't I'm not have sure. that. I'm not they sure. They don't have that in the UK. The, you the idea is in the UK. They don't have divorce you, in the UK because yeah. the king banned it. The king banned it, and also you're not allowed when when you marry the woman, she is your property now. Yeah, they don't they don't have divorce in the UK because every king has his queen. That's what they say there. <laughs> yeah. It's and, uh, it. No, yeah. it's not. And every it's queen not has just, her corgi. It's not just the man's vote. It's the household's vote. Right. Yeah. And of I've. Course. I've explained that to so many people, right. and they just don't <laughs> feel like they don't get it. It's <laughs> annoying when they're like, uh, what? You know? Have you seen the TikTok trend where they just make fun of British people by, like, <laughs> by, like, bringing up, like, a, like, a hypothetical, and it's like, um, you know, in America, we have to have security scanners to stop guns, and then it's a picture of a Dark Souls enemy, and it's like, well, yeah, in the UK, <laughs> <laughs> the grossest accents ever. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that would. I mean, that is pretty much Dark Souls. No mm -hmm. one speaks with an English accent or a, like an American accent. In that yeah, game, so. they're all British. Think about canonically. that. It, it's, it, actually, Elden Ring is the greatest Ireland representation in the game. Ugh. Now I don't want to play it anymore. Okay. Well, hurtful. Yeah. Irish didn't do anything wrong, you know. Well, I'm some Irish. I can say all this. <laughs> Doing the the prostate monster bit does not make you an Irish person. No, it does. But <laughs> I'm also real Irish. Oh, really? I got ah. I got like a hot 20% in me. Isn't that crazy? And then because he's run the bit so many times, it ups it to like 30. Yeah. Well, he's more Irish than I am. So I'm 115% of a person. You are the Irish representation on the show. No. Yeah. I just learned that. Plus I'm wearing green. And my prostate's the size of an orange. Oh, Aiden, come over here. I'm going to explore Get you. Get over here and let me suck on your prostate <laughs> like on, a I'm walnut. I'm going to explore your charm, Aiden. <laughs> Why does him talking about his prostate trigger you to start harassing Aiden? Well, this morning <laughs> we were driving home from the airport and... uh. I couldn't let it go. I just, I just kept giving it to him. Yeah. I, I, <laughs> Dude. I, I just kept, I said I was after his charm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. Which is his sweet, sweet inner G-spot for a man. <laughs> speaking, speaking of British people, me, me and Yingling were sitting next to each other on the plane. And uh, I think we're both in a similar space mentally as far as amount of sleep had and amount to drink the night prior. And... I look at the seat in front of us and I point and it says literature only. Which I don't know why it says that. And then I just said literature. <laughs> and then we started reading everything listed on the back of the seat in an English accent. And we settled on 737 being the... Yeah, they, I'm literally sitting in front of I want, Nick I want to give giggling context. to Nick back and, Nick Yingling back and forth about the numbers on the seat in front of us. Okay, I want to give and, context uh, to them just being... Just so fucking dumb for like a day because their brains were so broken. Yeah, you you, you came ready to podcast is what you're telling me. No, you, I you were slept. looking at 747 I'm... and you're like, this is it. Oh, but no, no, it, it, got, it got better I, because then, then the different number was like now. 800. Uh, I'm different now. 800 was also pretty funny. So. You're different now? Well, I didn't do it. Look at <laughs> Yeah, do it if it's I, so funny. I, 800. 747. 800. <laughs> yeah, right. Why wouldn't you do a British accent like you're a little schoolboy? Yeah, I think it's funnier that way. I hundred. Can you can you ask me for some pussy? <laughs> please, please, sir. Uh, <laughs> please, sir. Uh, just just a bit of just a bit of minge. <laughs> just a bit of pussy, sir. Yeah, you're like a Charles Dickens character. Yeah, Oliver Gash. <laughs> uh, I want. By the way, welcome back to the Yard Podcast. Welcome back to we, the Yard. The we, energy is palpable. Two of us crazy. are. Are for baby sleep bears. One hung over. <laughs> one just sucked down a whole pizza by himself. One's doing great. I'm doing. I feel great. You don't look great. That's hurtful. Well, you said it. Nick's didn't doing you? sexy voice. 
He is doing sex. Yeah. I just woke up. He has uh, to. I all nighter oh, last wait, night. We're doing the yard right now. Oh, oh fuck. Well, Welcome dude. back to the whatever the fuck this shit is, bro. Starring me <laughs> and the boys. Wait, we hit 20,000 patrons. That's so sexy. Oh, oh we did. Yeah, we had 20,000. Isn't yeah. that crazy? Here we a fresh little otter new body. I am creature. going to be such a smooth little man. I'm going to paint you like yourself with your with the same skin tones. I that's what's gonna look like is that I have painted body and, yeah. but because the hair will be gone I want and you to, can eat it if I want, you want to rip I want to do one rip <laughs> we also you, get one on everyone nip, gets a good, we we get one good and rip. it's our like you know you can buy like a yard in Ireland and now you're a lord or whatever mm -hmm. I want, I want my on strip your body. or it's like buying like a star in the sky <laughs> yeah I have slimes uh like left I think cheek. you guys should draw for the gooch Oh. oh wow! Yeah, I Wait, think is that I a punishment or a yeah. Wait, yeah I, <laughs> I, I, I was it, gonna say I'll give it to one. I of you. thought it'd be a reward. I was, <laughs> gonna, I was gonna say I was gonna say I kind of want to do that. Yeah, well there you go. So you and me, we've negotiated. Okay. I'll just do it. Hell there yeah, no, I love that. No hey. drawing for straws. That's like a uh, that's an unbreakable bond. Look, before I will have his dreams. Before we get too far away from it, because we were just talking about the plane, I just want to get this out now. I saw the shiniest head. I've ever seen on on the plane. I took a photo of it. No, oh. I was so mesmerized. I I look over at Aiden. And I say, I, shine. I hold in my iPhone with a message on it because I don't want to say it out loud. And I say I am mesmerized by this guy. And Aiden looks at the guy in front of us. Ah, <laughs> you took a picture. That is insanely shiny. Yeah, a so shiny head. so I look at and then Aiden replies and says, uh, "What did you say?" It looks like. It looks like the Zamboni just hit it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He said it looks like the Zamboni when it hits the ice. And yeah, you guys are just lighting up a bald dude in front of you. Not any bald dude. This is. I felt like if I rubbed no. him, I got wishes. No, this, this guy the, was so shiny. This is the shiniest head I've ever seen. <laughs> You're saying no? We didn't light up a bald guy. We lit up a really bald guy. Yeah. <laughs> you don't see the yeah, problem. It's so you don't see different. how this is problematic. You don't see how what you're doing hurts all of us. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't see that. Wow. Even with those with the, with hair. No, we were just doing on notes app back and forth, and then you know after thinking about it for a while, I leaned forward to him and I was like, "I'm making sure that y people like you can't vote." <laughs> <laughs> I I don't want you representing this country. Shiny <laughs> shiny bald is too far. Yeah, I've yeah. And the, his kid was next to him. I was like, "You better keep that fucking hair." Hey, uh, your your dad's got some <laughs> shit genetics. <laughs> Wonder what you got now. Yeah, when yeah. it when's it when's your doomsday clock up, little boy, Timmy, Timmy with the fucking bad dumb head. I'm, is mine shiny? <laughs> you look you look fine. No, no, no. It's, I'm not self conscious because I took, I just took a shower and I lotion on my head and then I, yeah. I I was brushing my teeth before this and I was like. I look really shiny more than more than usual. Yeah, on, it's a little shiny on it's top. It's a little shiny. Yeah, little shiny I can see you top. reflecting the light. I have a matte thing. It's like a matte sunscreen that like makes it not shiny. So you can I choose don't... your gradient. <laughs> so people <laughs> like, a, like, like shiny. a gaming monitor. Yeah, you can shine. <laughs> like like it's like it's pimp my ride. Well, yeah, with a jacuzzi on top. It's <laughs> the same thing with us hair havers. Like gel goes from matte to shiny. That's right. Yeah. Nope. Some people have flames painted on the side. Yeah, the guy Fieri. This right? guy was candy coated. The monster garage. This guy had the PS3 and the Xbox in the rear seat. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, man. God, that show is so... Dude, when, remember when we sat? We I, I think it was me, you, and Dan. We like we had an idea for a content piece for BTS, and it was like... It, you know in the beginning of Pimp My Ride where Exhibit will like... It's like filming down an alley, and then he'll like do 40 different walks, and, and then, then it, it flashes a light. It, and it's like 40 exhibits, and, and then he's like crouching down, and then he's like pointing, and then he's like <laughs> doing this. Uh, we we watched. There's like a video that does them all. Like puts yeah. it all in one video. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> dude, this is so hype. And we were like, how do we incorporate this? <laughs> yeah, just like a 10 minute video of this. This is what we got on the way to get another slice of pizza. <laughs> <laughs> and on the way to pet Durs. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> dude, oh, I can watch this all it's fucking so day. Hype. Oh, that's great. Oh man! Because some of them are there. Sometimes it's just him walking around like it, like he's lost. <laughs> 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 he does yeah. the waves. Yeah, yeah. Like who the fuck is he waving to? That's me. Me after getting 129th at Genesis. <laughs> <laughs> hey, come on. Hey, good job. Uh, Not bad. And that, yeah, that's actually pretty good. One two nine. I think that's what I got. When we, I got we, we we both, and Aiden both got 129. We both got 129. <laughs> really? yeah. yeah, that's hype. That's why I was like, let's on, go. On, yeah, man. we actually both did pretty well. There you go. That's great. Uh, Who'd you beat? Who'd you beat? The uh, I beat. Didn't lose the napkins. Didn't lose to napkins. Yeah, I beat mm -hmm. napkins. More importantly, didn't lose the napkins. Very yeah. nice. Uh, I beat. Uh, I don't. I don't remember. I, someone named 52%. Uh, 
Uh, yeah, I saw that. I, didn't I lost know who to, that was. The person I lost to in winners got thirty third, and the person I lost to in losers got sixty fifth. Mm. So I guess the grind didn't pay off. Ammon, I beat a uh, trap lord, but he was playing Falcon because he just switched to Falcon a month ago. Oh, but he, his Falcon was still trap lord from NorCal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And he Dude, just he, switched. Last time I interacted with that person, he was such a dick. Oh, oh, that's yeah. unfortunate. He was nice. In our it's nice and nice in real life, nice in real we life. Were, we, we were berating him behind it in sets. So yeah, he, and he was a great sport. So, wow. Yeah. So I have good. Which is to crazy because I out. I didn't hear so much of it, which I think is good because that pulls me pulls me out of it. Yeah. I was, Aiden, Aiden would hit him with any move, and I was yelling, "Uh oh, <laughs> it's Aiden time!" <laughs> and then I I beat a uh, PhD's nuts in the run back. Very nice. He beat me at Vertigo. A while ago, Verdugo. Ver- you, every time you say Vertigo, yeah. I want to break that Vertigo. fake window. <laughs> Ver- <laughs> Vertigo. No, but now, and now we're one. That, one that's what so. Michael Jackson had. It's not. You can't just say that. No, oh, it's like. It's like the U two album. It's like it's like <laughs> the thing that dogs get, and then they can't. They fall over. Hip mm-hmm. dysplasia. Yeah. No Different Vertigo. Way to fr- yeah, it's called Vertigo. <laughs> we brought a dog. There one. I can't remember whose dog it was, but one of the Evos Smash GG employees went to. And uh, one of the employees brought their like old dog who was like almost blind and had vertigo. And every time he tried to walk, he would just stumble around. Mm. And it, he he shat on the Evo v- convention center floor like three times because oh. every time he needed to poop, he wanted to go outside, but he didn't know how to get there. And he would if he tried to get up, he would just fall. That's so I, sad. Watching it. I don't know if you guys have ever seen a dog, an animal with four legs trip before, but it's sad. <laughs> my, my my dog died of this, yeah. Like, of tripping? No, had like some <laughs> old dog disease that gives them vertigo. Right. And their eyes are like always like moving side to side. You can like see it. And they like can't move. They eventually stop like being able to like walk around. And then like. Yeah, they just have to sit yeah. all day. That's so sad. Super sad. <laughs> they, at least they get to eat yummy food because they're dogs. True. Mm-hmm. And that's how you that's how you let him go out. That would be the only brightness in your day. At that's that how point. I would that's how Ludwig is gonna go out. He's gonna Eating cinnamon He's gonna get po- glue poisoning and then he'll be immobile and then I'll just feed him and feed him and feed him until he's dead. Poggy food today, slime. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm. <laughs> I met I met, uh, I met Polish at Genesis. We teamed together. Yeah. Polish is delightful. Yeah. I, I, Polish yeah. is a good person. You yeah. uh you teamed, right? We teamed. Yeah, we, got, you we got thirteenth. Um, they said that you had the best chemistry ever. It first, was, it first was, time team chemistry. So like, I, have, I have a lot of things that you guys are going to hate to hear. So first of all, we, oh. were, we were warming up versus uh, J-Mook and uh, Sora in Dude. doubles. And at first, J-Mook and Sora are destroying us. Like, it's like not close. And um, me and Polish have just met. We, have, we haven't said any words to each other. And I'm like, this is bad. We have bad chemistry. We're going to fucking get washed. I mean, I'm feeling bad because like, I'm by far the lower seed in this team. <laughs> And so I'm like, oh man, I'm, I'm not, I'm not gonna make them proud, etc. For for those at home who might not know, Polish is debatably the best peach in the Wait, world. Let's let's even let's was back seated up top a little. Eight at the event was seated top eight for singles. That makes sense. Yeah. yeah. Let's back up even a little further. It was Genesis Eight. If oh, yeah. you don't know shit about dick and balls and butt, Genesis Eight is a Smash tournament. It's like the Super Bowl of Smash mm-hmm. tournaments. Yeah. Let me like bring the, it back a little further. One. So Ken figured out. <laughs> <laughs> I wish my yes! foreskin could make a sound. <laughs> I want to. I want to elevate this, but I literally like you can't. You pull it out, and you're like. Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> <laughs> the bass notes. Like, I take Ludwig's and I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I. That's it's, what I try to do. I try to like pull it out and then blow across it like a bottle. Like, a, like no, like a leaf. <laughs> you're supposed to blow into it, and then it's a balloon, and then you let the air out and it goes. <laughs> your 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 foreskin. And then, and then your penis goes. <laughs> <laughs> and that's your, how we helicopter. Your foreskin oh is a is God. a jug with three X's on it. Uh huh. You, you, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you guys are you guys are pretty funny, huh? So uh, what it, what it, note do you think your foreskin would play? <laughs> <laughs> mine Pretty makes here. mine makes the corpse husband growl. <laughs> <laughs> foreskin. Uh, like a boor- I did it so good. I listened to a clip back when we talked about brought up corn husband, and I did a really good one. But I can't get there again. I, I need Nick early morning, a- aka got up voice. You know, m- most of it right now Wars is not even like that. I just Wars got up. Good. It's most that I was, I screamed so much at Genesis. Yeah, I, yeah. Because because Noir, our friend, oh, beat Zuppy. By the way, and beat a few other great players. Justin, aka Noir, he was the person who sat next to me. Me and him both endured the lecture from the guy from the party, aka Rob slash Active, who believes that the Earth is flat and that. 
so many things. Mm-hmm. I was telling us about how Bitcoin was in the Bible. We sat there for like 45 Bitcoin's minutes. Bitcoin's in the Bible? Yeah, that's what he was telling me. Shit, by uh, now. I know. <laughs> that makes <laughs> sense. And it was me and Justin <laughs> sitting there just being like, yeah, no, totally. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and I'm, and then I see him fucking beating all these people. I'm like, let's go. Yeah, Justin uh, was the best player at my college. And so I could never achieve number one because he was always better than me. And <clears throat> uh, I've always been telling people he's a hitter. And I was so excited. Cause, like every Genesis, he like... Like every Genesis in the past, he's kind of just like got nervous and got washed. And I'm like, one day Noir is going to go off. I'm going to be so excited about it. And this was his tournament. This is the time. So, what do you get? He got 65th. He was so close. Mm. To the tops. But he, had, he honestly had a really hard I mean, match. 65th is good. To make it, yeah. Uh, but he had a really, he got washed by Panda and then he played Stiv and had, they had a really Stiv, close Yeah, Stiv game Noir three. was a fucking banger, actually. Uh-huh. Yeah, it was a great set. Um, oh, Noir so sick. This, this part's only for me. You're talking about your doubles? Um, yeah, and then we beat uh, Zamu Salami, which felt nice. Oh, because, that's insane. I've lost to them before. Um, oh, but we know. So we're warming up for J Fook and Sora. We're doing terrible. And I was like, can I try just something really quick? And they're like, yeah, sure. I switched to Puff. We play Puff, and we're doing really good now. And and uh, we get out, and then we, I go back to Falco, and we're doing better is now. Is this in tournament? No, this is on friendly. Oh, okay, okay. Um, okay. I did end up playing Puff in tournament too. Um, but. Uh, after the setup, J Mook wrapping his controller, and me and J Mook haven't spoken to each other yet. And J Mook kind of leans in and is like, Your puff has no reason being that good. <laughs> Dude, I, I start laughing. Multiple like, people have told you that. I'm like, Can you go find Aiden? I'm like, I'm like, <laughs> and he did. I'm like, Can you go, I'm like, Can you go find Aiden? Can he you went just, and got you. Can you just tell no, him that. He comes up to me later that day, and this is also my first time meeting J Mook in person. <laughs> oh, tough. And, and you're like, like just, J Mook, by the way, he got second at the tournament, and it was the most insane run possibly of all time. I think it's the Melee. largest seed discrepancy to performance of yeah, all time. Yeah, it's unreal. Mm-hmm. And he, he beat a bunch of fucking good people. And he's also. Eamon's like, Eamon's like the J Mook fan club, like president. Oh, he's wearing. Oh yeah, he's what's up, the baby? Yeah, t-shirt. The, it's on. Yeah. Uh, Big old, and, and to be to to. Oh yes. To oh. our credit, me and Eamon, like when we would watch J Mook like a year ago and just like see him in an online brackets, we'd be like, dude, he's just so sick. Like I hate Sheik and I hate Aiden, and I, we would break <laughs> bread over this man playing fucking Sheik, and we'd be like, that's that's how you each know J Mook is cool. That's how I explain it to people. It's like. Think about how much Anthony hates Sheik. A- Anthony Aiden thinks into me. this guy is he cool. He leaned into me during the grand finals and he goes, how many times do you think Anthony has said Aiden's never done that today? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Not as much as you'd think. Yeah. Maybe I wasn't we'll, thinking maybe, about maybe you. Maybe once or twice. I was crying. I was hugging Atriot yeah. at the front of the <laughs> they fucking were hugging theater. And jumping in circles. It was beautiful. I, 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 was, I, I had my come to God moment last night because when he, when Cody, uh, so Cody has to play him, right? And in my head, I'm like, him versus Cody is going to be worse than him versus Zane. Like I thought, because he got like, shit on yeah. by Zane, and and you made a little bet, and I made a little bet. I, I Ben S W was trying to fucking farm me, which he kind of did, and then I got my one piece in at the end, and I got my twenty dollar <laughs> bet that J Mook would not get three would and I thought that was a fair bet. Um, and J Mook ends up three owing yeah. IBDW, yeah. which was insane. And in the middle of the third game, I said, if this happens. I will never complain about Fox Sheik ever again. Oh. And it happened. Yeah. So I will never I will never complain about Fox Sheik. I'm also Sheik announcing ever again. my switch to Fox. Oh. And I'm going to abuse Yeah, I was thinking that too. His worst I could just play Fox. And Aiden can't say anything. Yeah. yeah that's yeah. a fun that's a fun little abuse. I will, yeah. Mango said he will train me when he was over here yesterday. Mm-hmm. To to basically well the rest of the sentence in my head is to make Aiden sad. <laughs> but but he didn't say that part. Well, he but said that's he'd what just it would train be. you. Yeah, but then like that's implied. But that to make the me implication, sad. Yeah, the okay, result well, is you will be sad, which makes nice. him happy. Yeah, you're you're I look. Happiness is a finite resource that is passed around. Hmm. It and I need it from you. In the words of Doctor Nooseland, melee is a zero sum game. No, it's an not. Em- because, an emotional zero sum. No, because I get the. No, that's, yeah, you're right. Yes, that's yeah. what is. Yeah. Ah, so you're that's what zero page. sum games are. <laughs> he gets there. Let him get there. <laughs> I got there. <laughs> uh, yeah, J Mook. I met him too. <laughs> so it, it's funny, oh, you went God. to Genesis. Uh huh. For one day. What? What? I, I flew in to do my mashing thing. I had a clocked in and clocked my mashing out. idea where I would try to challenge people in mashing, and uh, and and I'll tell you how that went in a second. But first, I. I was at a pizza place and I was watching J Mook versus Plup, and J Mook was beating Plup. And I have only heard J Mook from you guys talking about him. Yeah, I don't really watch so Melee, but I'm like, I'm like, oh, J Mook's supposed to be sick. Aiden loves him. I'm talking to Stans because Stans knows even less than I do. 
So I'm giving him context. And then he starts beating Pluff's ass, and I'm like, damn, he's fucking sick. And Fissette finishes, I'm like, wow, Aiden's right. He's a god. I walk in the venue. Bunch of people asking for pictures all weekend. This guy comes up to me, and he's like, hey, can I get a pic? And I'm like, yeah. Takes a pic. And then he's like, oh, bad angle. Do it again. I'm like, fine. Take like it that. In. And then he's like, all right, see you later. And then he runs off towards the stage. I'm like, cool. And then I see him walk <laughs> on the stage. I'm like, that's weird. And uh, <laughs> and, uh, and another friend of ours, Zane, comes up, and he's like, yo, you, uh, that guy you took a picture with? I'm like, yeah, yeah. He's like, oh, that's Jay Mook. I'm like, that's Jay. Zane told you that? E Pe e Peng Peng yeah. Zane. Oh, E Peng. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm like, I'm like, oh, what? Yeah. And he's like, yeah, that's Jay. I'm like, oh, I feel kind of bad. Yeah. Also, because you were, you, the, the, as the story goes, you were talking about how sick Jay Mook is. Like, you've been fucking following the career. Yeah, like you've been done no. Yeah, like you've been done no, but you haven't been done no. No, I just said he was sick because he beat Plup five seconds earlier. If he hadn't beat Plup, I wouldn't have been like, Jay Mook's sick. It was very reaction to the thing that okay, so happened. Okay. okay. It also adds to the theory, by the way. Uh, it could be learned that Jay Mook listens to The Yard, that The Yard is the podcast of champions. The podcast of champs. Wow. Yeah. Love that. Wait. Close to champs. Okay. You well, know. does they not listen to the yard? Big come town guy, actually. <laughs> Imagine. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just listen. Love Stavi, baby. That, after after that. grand finals, I hit Zane with the bro. You spilled beer all over your shirt thing, and like <gasps> put the finger up and him in the nose, and he he was in shambles. He yeah. was crushed. The yeah, bit's yeah. evolved, by the way. I don't like the direction this bit has gone in. Oh, it, oh my god. The so, new the new version of the bit is the person the, yeah. pointing at the thing that is on your shirt, being like, "Oh, that's a like." I had a Phantom T-shirt on one day. And I think Dom got me, and he was just like, "Oh, that's a Phantom shirt." And then I'm like, "Oh yeah." And then he flips me. Oh, you're such like, a you're such a dumb that's bitch. Just the the better, thing the that my version, shirt is. The better version of this is uh, so we met Bundun, um, which is one of the Aussie guys' friends. Um, great, great dude. Um, and we uh, <laughs> Bundun and Josh are like going somewhere, and Josh Josh drops his mask out of his pocket, but doesn't know. And Bundun says, "Josh, you dropped your pocket," and points at the mask. That's oh and my puts god. Puts him in a scenario. Where Josh can't look down because he's owned, but if he doesn't look down, he doesn't know that he's dropped his mask. Yep. And so Josh goes like, "I'm not looking down, bro." And Bundan's like, "Ah, okay." And then later, Josh <laughs> is like, "Where's my mask?" Oh, that's and such a and that's such a like, gift. Earlier, I told you you dropped it. He's like, "You said you dropped your pocket." He's like, "Yeah, it was your mask." I don't know. I said, <laughs> I said pocket. And, oh, that's such a gift in that spot was, if you're bundled. Yeah, it was so fucking good. I'm like, damn, you really just put him in an unwinnable scenario. Well, I, one time, I, I was actually at main stage. Nick Yingling, like, his phone fell out of his pocket, and he didn't notice. So I just grabbed it, and I put it in my pocket. <laughs> and then I just watched the television show that was him. <laughs> People love running that bit. The old take the phone, and then just, then they're uh, like, where's my phone? And then, like, maybe an hour later, you're like, this Dude, phone. I waited so God. long. You wait a while. I waited, wait, I waited too long. Yeah. Was it? Was it there was a smash summit where where YouTube King couldn't find his phone, right? And he was literally asking every single person in the venue if they had seen his phone, just like walking around. And it was like it, <laughs> it was like I, disruptive. Yeah, it yeah. was just like he, he and he would come back. He like circle back. He's like, "Have you seen my phone like now?" I was like, "No, I it's, it's <laughs> been it's been like 15 minutes. I haven't found your phone." Dude, crazy is that we were at uh breakfast and Atriot gets a call and he's like, "Hey, uh, what's up?" And he, he doesn't know who it is, random number. And the guy's like, hey, I have your passport. And Atriox didn't even know he lost the passport. And the guy had it and found him before Atriox was smart enough to realize he lost it. Two things. Listen, Atriox, we're beefing. Yeah? There's a clip. I get recommended clip channels. I'm actually a clip channel uh, connoisseur. Sure. Mm -hmm. Don't change it. Okay, now we're bad. Now we're demonetized. Yeah, you definitely, uh, Archie, you better fucking... Fuck. Okay. Oh, by the way, we can't swear in the first like three minutes of our video. Two minutes. Two minutes. So, oh shit, we should have we should have gave Archie a, like a like a speed run <laughs> or like a, like a stress test. Well, we should have stress test Archie. People can just know that we're gonna if we if we say something funny in the first two minutes, we'll just bleep out the word. It won't be bleep though. It'll be just like muted. And that, and it, and yeah. I, we should have done that, but I forgot. It's okay. Okay. To anyway, swear. listen to me. All right. Atrioc. Right. He had a clip where he was he was like fake stream mad at and he said it was cringe how you showed susan bojack the people shy waiting for bus emo uh -huh. people waiting for bus right and he said it was so fucking cringe that he did that see you on youtube and i was like you fucking bootlicker what are you doing and i messaged him and mm -hmm. i said you are a fucking bootlicker for this and, <laughs> and when the revolution comes you will not be spared yeah and then i sent him a cool starcraft clip <laughs> immediately <laughs> did he reply after. to the starcraft he didn't clip? reply at all wow tough
He, yeah, he did make fun of that, and then I was self conscious, and I pussy. asked a few people. I was like, "Was it cringe?" Because you know the public reaction was generally everything was pretty good. He just he just thinks that because it's like the fucking it's like a tech giant that he he needs to like fucking. It's it's funny well, your line for this is him him saying that when he works for Nvidia. Yeah. He works for one of the big dogs already. I know. He's That's why he's a, such he's a huge been pussy. Licking boots. I know, for but stocks. for him to for him to say that, I know. Uh, yeah, ten more, like, please. Said, oh, give me more boot. <laughs> I need it right now. <laughs> it's so cringe. And if they're looking for any marketing director, it's so cringe. He's the one who fucking so brought cool. up Crinky Crunchmas. Are you fucking <laughs> kidding me? What? That's so disgusting. Actually, I'm, I like when I'm he's so on my side. I'm so fucking mad you about you this. You would have told Susan about Crinky Crunch. I'm so fucking mad about. Imagine Atrioc interviewing Susan Wojak. He's like, like a fucking cartoon wolf. <laughs> Dumb piece of shit. Don't fucking call him cringe. <laughs> I'm so mad. <laughs> but also, I heard he, he missed out on JMook. Yeah. He, he was supposed to sponsor that's, JMook. That's your comeuppance is mm -hmm. he talked about sponsoring JMook for like a month leading up to this event and then didn't follow up because he's Atrioc. <laughs> and then JMook got top eight winners and then wanted to... Sponsor him for Sunday, but couldn't seal the deal. Yeah, he could. He was trying to get him to wear the Enron hat on stage on the last day, and uh, J Mook backed out because he was like, "I just don't want to like put anything on. I'm not used to." Yeah, J Mook was like concerned it would influence how yeah, he feels, and which I think is totally play. fair. Like yeah. if you if you never play with like something on your head, I feel like that is a weird thing. No, I think it's great, especially but when you're in winner side of fucking top eight at Genesis, also, baby. Let's go, J Mook. More, more good uh, news for you and bad news for Atrioc. He missed his flight to the event. Yes, yes. So, so as the plane is about to take off, he's supposed to fly with Brian Tran. He sends Brian Tran a text. He says, "Hey, when's the plane take off?" Brian is on the tarmac. <laughs> the, the plane is taxiing. Yeah, he's not. He's almost not allowed to be texting right now. It's it, it's a full LMAO all caps reply. <laughs> Atrioc was late because he didn't pay his taxes yet. Dude, you know, I was gonna bring this up it, because I knew when you told me he like uh, never got a response or. J Mook never got a response or whatever. Um, or wait, no, he just never reached out, right? He never reached out before he this. Thought he, he, was going, he didn't follow up. They talked yeah. about it, but yeah. Okay, he never followed up. So Atriac actually sits down. I give him my time. I uh -huh. sit down with him for like 45 minutes. I teach him how to do accounting, basic bookkeeping to be a streamer. Because he's like, I haven't done shit. I don't know what the fuck. I'm, I'm like scared. And I'm like, okay, that's fine. We'll like talk about it. And I was like, yeah, I'll just tell you everything I do for Ludwig. And then he's like, okay. And then I tell him everything he needs to do. And then he's like, would you do this for me for money? And I said, yes. And we talked about it a little bit. And then he just never followed up again. Nice. And then, and then he was late doing his taxes. Yeah. I'm so fucking happy about that. Yeah. He, dude, his life is like, it's like, how do I budget my time? And it's like, all right, work hours uh, and then like important streams and then hanging out with my fiance. And then it's like 16 hours of playing Elden Ring on Saturday and Sunday. <laughs> He's like, what can I cut to figure out the rest of my stuff? <laughs> Please, my family is dying. And then he looks at Ari. He's like, maybe <laughs> we just don't hang out as much. Maybe you watch me play Elden Ring yeah. for 16 hours. I just got Rivers of Blood. It's going to be fun now. Um, but yeah, anyway, that concludes our fuck Atrioc portion. Have you guys heard of this Japanese kid show? <laughs> yeah, you, oh, is it the toddler saying, show? You keep saying it that way. <laughs> I, that's worse. You keep saying no, no, it this yeah, way. I like the way you keep no, it's the saying show it. with the with the toddlers. No, you, and you, seen watch, these kids? you watch toddlers. No, you actually the way he explains it because I already heard him do this is worse. It sounds worse. <laughs> it's a show about Japanese kids called Old Enough. No, yeah. <laughs> I feel like that's. I forgot that was a fucking. Maybe they name. should name it something else. No, it's just called old enough. <laughs> why are you? <laughs> Stop, don't say, say it like why? that. Why? The tone of your voice is, I've, and your eyes are all changing. Like your whole facial expression. Don't italicize oh, the title of this I with your voice. I'm gonna go old enough. We're gonna say it on three together. Okay. One, two, two three. three. Old enough. Old enough, yeah, that sounds great. So it's a Japanese kid in old enough, <laughs> and the idea is you get one kid, like one, like little Japanese kid. Yeah. And good kid. You great strong kid. kid. Strong, strong kid. Powerful kid who's old enough. <laughs> and you take him and you give him a task. You okay. know, like it's a mogus. Right. And then you the keep whole feeding him vegetables. <laughs> feeding him. You keep feeding. <laughs> the whole show is I'm feeding him until he gets strong. <laughs> <laughs> and he's he's there for a while. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh and, but they have little cameramen fall not little, they're normal sized cameramen. Uh but they follow the little kid around who's not normal sized. 
doing a task. It'd like, be funny if they had tiny cameramen, like demi humans oh, from Elden Ring, or other kids <laughs> role playing. The whole production, yeah. the whole production crew is old enough. It, it's just a, <laughs> yeah. it's just a bunch of three and four year olds holding okay, cameras. Okay, here, here's a clip Zipper's bringing up. Yeah, it's a ten year old show in oh, in cute. Japan. This is cute. Uh, but but it just got popular on Netflix. I think they might have just gotten access to it, and it's it's like trending. It's like everywhere. So I've been showing it to a bunch of people. Uh, and yeah, I, you showed it to Mango. I showed it to Mango. Yeah, Hammer. Did he like it? He was okay. So Mango came over because he lost. He got ninth in Genesis. First time ever not being top eight. First time not being top eight in years. Um, and and he was sad, but I was like, hey, come over to my place. We'll commentate together. He's like, I'm down. It's actually great. Leaving Sunday from a tournament is amazing, and you can just watch it from the cover of your home. And you don't have, yeah. to have like the Monday tired like fucking the Sunday late. When yeah. I would know what that's like. It feels better for the soul. I'm charged yeah, right now. You can now. actually see who went to Genesis. Yeah, yeah. Call him yeah. Mario Strikers. But also, did you get. But you're a social guy. Yeah, I mean, so like, like, I wanted to time. hang out with people. Like, Aiden, when he's drunk, he's Aiden, just like. Aiden was. <laughs> great. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Man. What happened? Aiden, Aiden insisted on being in the middle of the street. Oh, while yeah? he was drunk, and I was pull, I was trying to pull him back out of the middle of the street. He's like, "No, no, I remember and, and, this. And I thinking, was looking in the distance. Yeah, there were yeah, no keep, cars. Yeah, yeah, he keeps going. There's no. Whoa, oh, oh, the cars are so close, there man. Were no, They're so yeah. close. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm like, I like that. I'm yeah, not worried about that. the cars that are coming. I'm worried about the cars that you're not gonna be thinking about because you're in the middle of the street singing Mo Bamba and censoring Hold all the on, and censoring oh. all the words you're not allowed to say. Uh, that, that's good because at Genesis five, they didn't do the, that. The reason not, they not being Aiden, they being the Cont and, the contestants I, of Genesis and, 5. And Pepperidge Farm remembers. We were <laughs> and that's why it's a joke every time Obama comes up at these fucking tournaments because you all said it. Because when they're playing with a young person's phone, the we, reason, know. The reason, <laughs> we know. The reason that this came up last night is so I can't remember who it was, but someone postured the question at the bar that... If Hbox got up on the stage he says and it. sang the full lyrics to Mo Bamba in front of everyone right now, would he be canceled? More fans. And we were <laughs> debating this. Dude, yeah, he, he he does not survive that because... That's what I said. He posted... Hbox posted to r slash black people Twitter his own tweet. Yeah. Yeah, yeah he's an oh, ally. He's, a, he's an ally. Oh, he's an <laughs> what do you want, dude? Sorry, he stands. I... I <laughs> And I, I, stand. I still can't believe I still literally cannot believe he did that and he was dressed up like a douche the whole fucking tournament too I'm just watching from home Dude, I'm on my was, back he I, was character acting the whole week he was it was incredible we, I don't know we might cut this I don't know I'm gonna bring it up though he came up to me and he was like I heard a rumor and I'm oh, like, I'm really like, I don't like that starter, dude. He does intro ominously. He intros like the fucking Joker. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm like, what's the rumor? And he's like, I heard that you and the Ludwig crew are planning a roast of me. I was like, what? <laughs> hey, Juan. Like, no, Wait. Wait. dude, that's funny because he no. went up to me and we were talking, and he said in the elevator, he's like, dude, imagine like a roast of Hungry Box. Like, he he posted like that. And I oh, replied, dude, so, so Huey was right. Huey had a theory that he was just trying to plant the idea in my brain. He's dude, he was accepted. Wow. He was accepted. He's next level. That's the next this level. This is crazy. This is why I'm H fan. I have more what, respect what, for him. What? 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 what, what, what let's what, go. What. I don't have enough content energy to do that. <laughs> I'm just mad. I'm actually just mad. Your back dude, hurts too much. It was he, actually legendary he, marketing. I couldn't believe that he played so well on Sunday because there was this there was this hotel room party. Um, by the uh oh the sixty nine party sip, by the trip sip guys, hmm? the sixty nine party the sixty nine party yeah. it, it hurt people and the sixty nine I did not right? go it's like but, a brand yeah yeah, yeah. the sixty nine party uh, it's not where they do sixty nine it's 69%. not where they do sixty nine I get worried bro 69%. I get worried everyone's going to the fucking <laughs> tournament and we just got out we got out of fucking COVID we got out of the fucking the scandal woods. I get. I've worried no, I was about good. it. I mean, six four is sucking fuck floor, but like I saw that was pretty chill. Pretty chill. <laughs> I, I don't know, man. The He's, hentai booth was getting fucking static from on Twitter. I was like, this is good. This is progress. I uh, hope that that party went really, really late. Apparently, uh, Dom Dom was like, Dom was fucked up at like five p.m. the next day. That's so hype. <laughs> yeah, Dom Dom showed and up he, late to top eight because he was puking. Yeah, <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> and it's just no sleep. And apparently Juan went to the party. <laughs> he had to play on Sunday, but he was at the party. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. And I caught him in the elevator after he had left, like in the middle of the night. And he's just leaning in the elevator, 
on his phone. And I'm standing there with him and like two other people I don't know who are not with him. And then all of a sudden in the elevator, he says, the world is such a cruel, cruel place. (laughs) (laughs) Dude. That's so weird. That's sick. And then I was like, I was like, in my head, I was just like, damn. He just like, watched a Kingdom then, Hearts 4 trailer. And then, <laughs> and then a few, Isn't it crazy? A, a few seconds passed by, and he was just he looked at me specifically, and he was like, Aiden, there's too much hate in this world. And I was just like, yeah, I mean. We have to vanquish the hate. The, 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 Dude, the worst man you know just made a great point. <laughs> the crazy context of this is I was also on the elevator that same night. And I was trying to get snackies and water because we were devoid of it in our room. And dry, uh, riding down the elevator was the host of the party. Oh, Trip. I think, yeah. yeah. He was some guy with a 69% hat. And he was like, yeah, we had a crazy party in the 69% room. It's fucking crazy. <laughs> and I was right. like, and that I was sounds like, great. that's tight. And people really like sharing with me because I'm Ludwig and they know me. You're Ludwig. And they're, so he was, like, he was like, yeah, Juan was there. And I was like, that's crazy. And he was like, yeah. He was on his phone the whole time on Twitter, and I went up to him for a little bit, and I was like, yeah, I'm not the great, the biggest Juan fan, but I was like, hey, great play. And he was like, the world is full of hate. And he's just moody all night. Something wow. happened. Wow. Something then he, affected Juan. Doom scrolling. Doom scrolling. But it's, but it's your own doom. And then he showed mm. up at top eight and still played, and, and then still beat Laud in the war of attrition that with, we yeah, all with watched. With the Rick Ross shades on. I think my, my, my favorite Juan experience, it was Genesis 4 or 5, and it was at the, uh, the, the big hotel where there's like that valet, right? And it's late at night. It's like Saturday night, maybe Sunday night. And uh, Crunch, his coach, used to be his coach. I don't know if he still is. He's like wasted on the sidewalk, and he's like puking. <laughs> And it's really funny because mm-hmm. he's just doing that. It's it's always funny. And then well, a bunch of us are watching from inside the lobby because there's this huge glass pane wall where you can see into the valet. And Crunch is just like fucking throwing up. And I forget who's even with me. It was like Miles or something. We're me. just like, oh, yeah? yeah. We're just like laughing. It, was, like, it was me, you, and Ben. Oh, it was me. It's, that's right. Yeah. And like, ha, ha, ha. And, uh, <laughs> and H-Box, he sees us laughing. He's hammered, too. He turns, and then he just starts banging on the glass like a gorilla. <laughs> and he's like, what are you looking at? He's screaming at us. Yeah. And, Keep looking. And it's what like, are you even looking at? It's like in the movie with like you hear him screaming and raging, and the music's loud, and then uh-huh. it cuts to inside the lobby, and you hear like the little elevator music. Yeah, yeah it's and just we're like, <laughs> Is he looking at us? <laughs> Dude, it, it was so fucking funny. <laughs> He, was, he brought it up. We were uh, the Genesis. We were we were walking um, home from uh, Guildhouse, and each box was like in our big unit of people walking, and um, uh, some guy, some guy is just like puking all over the sidewalk, and uh, I'm sort of like trying to just get around it and ignore it. And his homie, we're walking by, and his homie just goes, "Be respectful." And I'm, <laughs> and I, start, I start laughing because like the funniest. thing What does that say. mean? He thought we were gonna make fun of the guy puking. Cause like it's a big group of guys and he's like going crazy and we're uh, like I, so he was like be respectful y'all he but he's also laughing like he just, okay okay like oh, he's yeah. kind of just like yeah like he just knows it. the whole and, I, and I'm laughing because I'm like I did want to say something but I won't that was un- un- that too. was one unironically and then because uh, if you're puking on the side of the street like y- you you made your bed I mm-hmm. could I could never make fun of them because that's been me it's a not few about making times. fun of them it's just about being able to be like yo yo that that. <laughs> Sucks. But that's I learned, crazy that I learned that's you. more details about the story because Juan brought this up unprompted because the guy was puking and he was he, he told that story about the guy at Genesis and I I didn't have the heart to even mention that I was there. I was like, <laughs> wait, I, what? I was listening and he's like, yeah, he, uh, that guy was like, he was like puking in the car, like the Uber on the way over, all over himself, and then we got out and there's all this lore and context I can't get into about it. But wait, the same moment that I just described. Yeah, yeah, he started but talking his about POV, it. and that's the thing about it is there's two, tr- three truths. That's right. And Yours one is lie. in the reality. And God, Jesus Christ. Well, I think to, to, to start getting towards the closing out of Genesis, uh, one thing that I didn't realize was the case until the after party after top eight was a large group uh, in Zipper. I sent you a photo you could bring up. A large group of yard viewers went to Genesis that don't play Melee. Really? They yeah. they don't play Smash yeah. titles. Did they play? Like from the Discord. I don't know if they entered, uh, but I, a lot of them came up and said they like, this was like a con. For them, like they all, <laughs> like they all went Ugh. and they they caught dinner at Yard House. Nice, and I like Yard House. Holy shit, and that's so many people. Yard House is a nice chain. Look how many people there were. That's so many people. Yeah, yeah, this is so cool. But they don't play the game. Uh, Presumably, some play some the of, game. Some of them do because I feel like that's like Afghans on the right. 
Um, yeah. But yeah. Uh, a, a lot of them don't. Guys, if you're going to fake the funk, at least get a controller. Just, hey, well, just no, you can just play go the game. Just it, bro. They're just having fun if they're yeah, not playing. Slime I get it. Like it. They want to like watch. I just, I just, I I, I, look. I'm not trying to be pissy. I just hope that they play the game. They hang out in the Discord and watch each other play the game all the time. Welcome to the new age. I will defend them. Get on them. Get on them. Because well, I think they had, the a, future, they had a great man. time. I think that looks hype. I think that look. It's like lifelong connections that a, you'll never forget. There was a group of them that were pretty rowdy, and they were arm wrestling everyone at the venue. Yeah, and it got pretty hype. Nice. But there's a bunch of strong lads that were there. We got strong viewers. We had a couple strong ones. I yeah. love having powerful viewers. They were, they were, there was a crowd of people with the grip strength tester around the oh, bar. Oh, yeah. And they were all going around there roasting everyone who couldn't hit as much as their friend. Dude, who was? <laughs> yeah, one of, I forget his name. I feel bad. What's he, hitting? Uh, he He maxed. What, you, he maxed the. No, no, no. He was hitting like 167. No, one of them hit 190, 198, and it caps it caps oh, out I at like 199 or I something. I saw one, 167. That's almost a whole Ludwig. Yeah, that's crazy. Just crushing <laughs> no, you like an egg. Because they did it. They had hand. me do it okay. at the after party. I, I hit my, I hit my one hundred and four. One hundred and four. Dang. Dang. Been stuck in the nineties for a while, so Yeesh, three digits. And then, I, and then I was <laughs> sadly telling them how Ludwig beats me out by like forty pounds. I was like confessing this. To you, them. I like how you were honest. You said, "Don't cheer for me." Hey, oh, they weren't cheering hey, for me. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I also, I also do that though. So you know, it's not too bad. It's like both of us doing it. Hey, Cooter stays winning in two things: grip strength and mashing. Okay, yeah, I, so I'm glad I, that I you have, still got it. I did I, have a I, question. I'm, awesome, Nick. I'm very. I lost my two. Awesome. Two. Lost two. Lost by three. What? It was uh, 193, 190. Three? Yeah, it was three. I don't think that's the case. I think he's lying. He's wrong. Be I'll I heard. Bet. I heard Zipper yapping. Oh, three. 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 Oh, I, so shit. I didn't see what it was. I was told it was two after. So mm. I have a question for you. Uh huh. Because this is the first tournament you've attended since before COVID and yeah. becoming famous Ludwig man. Sure. So did it suck or did you enjoy yourself? I imagine you would not I feel like you left kind of early and Dude. you do and you wouldn't want to do it again. I left used and cum filled. Fucking we not a you, second You alone. weren't cum filled. You uh, filled Genesis with the cum. I'm saying not a person went up to me who didn't want to swap a little spit. It was just, it was nonstop for about like three hours when I got there because I landed and I immediately went to the venue because I set up my stream for three. Yeah. And I was there from like three to like six or seven. And it, it was the whole time. When you tried to leave the venue, I, I just spectated for a bit and it was actually insane to watch this kid getting aggroed yeah yeah I, i'm dude i'm an a like i'm, I'm an aggro unit and everybody dude, was part getting pissed that off i found weird i don't know i don't even know if you like chose this or anything but um like cloud nine set up like a like a cage for him like they gave him like like they roped him off <laughs> in a square of concrete <laughs> literally nothing in the concrete they just mm -hmm. they roped him off and they allowed a line to funnel into the ropes of area to like meet him. This was for the mashing thing. No, 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 no. no. It was, was just for after. Just, <laughs> just me and Ludwig and just mashing standing mashing in a square. Over. Mashing, mashing is, over. is over. It's all packed away, and then next to this booth is a square on the concrete with nothing inside and, of it. Literally nothing, not Lud a table. Ludwig's signature and photo time. And then there's individuals entering to meet Ludwig <laughs> and talk to him and have their individual moment. And I was like, "This is crazy." <laughs> well, what That's happened so funny. is I was doing the mashing thing. The mashing thing was like, "Beat me in mashing, win all the money I've I've raised." And I started with a hundred dollars in, and it got up to seven hundred five dollars before no, nobody challenged me. I, I, I played over a hundred people and then I was like, you know what? It's good. I don't need to give $5 to lose. Uh, and so I stopped it. But behind me the whole time were spectators. We're just watching. Mm -hmm. And so when I was done, I said, hey, you guys are really nice for hanging out the whole time. Like we can do like a little meat thing. The so bud, that, the bud wigs. They set up the thing and I walked in the middle and I said, well, welcome to the prize cow show. And then they all <laughs> went up. And I and I talked to them all, and it was great. It was really nice meeting everyone. Yeah, you like that. I'm like I I, I, I have the the interaction nailed down. I'm very good at that interaction. Yeah, it's really special for them. I'm sure. I look. They, I think they have a great time. Yeah, you've optimized it. You you've put it on a fucking printing press, and you just fucking doesn't. Hey, what's your name? Hey, what's your name? Well, Stan <laughs> came up to me because like what what you guys probably have dealt with at least early on, but maybe you're better at it now. Is like when people recognize you. They don't expect to see you there because you're not like plan. It's not like a plan. Meet Nick at this corner where yeah, we yeah. real come. quick before we move on from that. Uh -huh. I had a guy who leaned over to ask me a question. He was like, "Do you know when like bracket starts?" And then midway <laughs> through asking the question, like saw me and said, "Oh, oh, sorry." Yeah, it's he apologized. Yeah, better not fucking talk to my man. He mans. apologized to talking to me. That's right. And I was like, 
Yes, can, sir. I'm like, you can ask me the question. God damn, God damn like, what right. What the fuck was that? Yeah, yeah, so, so, so I guess yeah. he knows then. Good. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I fucking punched him in the mouth, idiot. Well, that, well that's what happens. It's yeah. like so people will walk around and then podcaster, don't freak out. Their bud. AOE will like the the AOE will be triggered and you'll be in the range and they'll be like, yeah. And then they'll be like, oh my god, and they did not expect to have an interaction, so they have planned nothing <laughs> at all. Except for... Which is how humans should kind of operate. You like, p- immediate, I know you, and I like you. Yeah, yeah. But then what Very will Charlie happen... Charlie Day-esque. This is what will happen if you don't, like, do anything. <laughs> if you just, like, react to it, and you're just like, oh, cool, how's it going? They'll just stand there. And they'll, like, a lot of people will just be like... Yeah. And they don't have anything to say, and they're, like, thinking, like, what should I say... And some people nail it. Some people are like, "Dude, love what you do. That's all." Hey, just want. Hey, have a great, have a yeah. great tournament. Oh, I love the. Ooh, if you're a if you're a fist bump, love what you do, and fucking give us both breathing room forever. You're you're a gem. It's the you're a chaos emerald. <laughs> yeah, those are the good people. And some people know what they want. They're like, hey, "Can I get a pick? Can you sign this?" Also oh, a chaos emerald. Sure. Stay with me for a moment. Oh. I want you all. I want to paint a picture. Imagine while you're looking at this man. Imagine that you are him. Okay, you're hungry, obviously. <laughs> If this is going where I think it's going, I'm going to be upset at you. But what are you hungry for? It's not just slop. <laughs> slop, trough food, you're mud sitting, water. You're sitting there. You're sitting there. You're you're watching a lot at home because you're stinky too. You're s- <laughs> no, not during the raid. No. <laughs> so I avoid it. So I avoid it. No, okay. you can't use that as the Archie, Archie, I want you to put over his <laughs> cheeks nordvpn.com <laughs> slash the yard yeah yeah uh, because that's our sponsor for this because uh, you should be hungry for privacy okay and nordvpn.com slash the yard use the code and you get a little discount and you can keep be and you can keep your secrets private because ludwig wants the secret of his weight to be private but he can't because it's physically appears on him I'm fucking fight you <laughs> but he can't i can't wait for you to heal I can't so nordvpn.com slash the yard <laughs> it's <laughs> <laughs> it's like a VPN. Step to me. It is a VPN. It is a VPN. It, it isn't like a VPN. Here's the thing. There's no VPN so for your body. Here. Let me give you a visual. <laughs> so Ludwig's trying to attack slime. And me, NordVPN comes in and I, I, I pull out a switchblade. I say, hey Ludwig. Hey Ludwig, you can't do that or I'll fucking kill you. Hey, and also, t- and t- also I'm going to hide where he lives. <laughs> That's what NordVPN does for your data online. Nord, NordVPN. That's right. they'll, fuck it, they'll fucking kill you. So... so <laughs> <laughs> there's no there's no VPN for your body. <laughs> Dude, Ew, it's cold. Don't look at Ew, it's oh, cold. God. You're kinda dude, you're kinda jacked. <laughs> yeah, you're looking your traps are looking good right now, I'll say that. And so nordvpn.com <laughs> slash the yard and Sub Nate ah! Mask your IP ah! uh watch anime that's uh uh region locked. Uh, all sorts of things you could do with a good you, VPN. You can watch other things that are region locked. It doesn't have to be anime. You they, can watch. Our, you know our viewers don't watch, watch yeah. no, watch anime. Things that unfortunately, are anime. Take a break. you Take can a break. watch You've anime. You've watched a lot of anime lately. Take a break. Take a break. Stop <laughs> watching anime. Watch a normal TV show with North You're talking VPN. shit on anime, Aiden? Hmm? Oh, and Ludwig <laughs> gives him a two. And with that, we come out of the read. Thank everyone. Thank you, NordVPN. Back to the regularly scheduled content. I wanted to, I wanted to tell you that um, Polish had mentioned... Uh, that really, really liking your Valorant streams, <gasps> and uh, and also mentioned like, but I would never go up and tell him because then he'd hate me forever. And I was like, no, he wouldn't. He wouldn't hate you forever. Nope. He, he would. You're no. you're a god tier gamer, and so it would mean a lot. God tier gamer. Funny on Twitter and uh, humble and the, just really handsome. I was telling that Magi helps. this last night. I was I was breaking this down for Magi because she was talking about how she watches Slime's Valorant streams all the time. <laughs> Magi's and, a huge and about fan. how she's a patron. <laughs> And I'm, <laughs> and I was explaining how like any all of the god I was explaining her to her, to her how how Quinn Dota makes slime feel and I was like you're in that yeah. group yeah see here's the thing I think god gamers like watching me because I remind them of who they were and and in a way still <laughs> okay am. hold on no like I'm a shit I'm a shitter I suck and then they watch me and they're like I'm sick at the game but that's still like I I grew up doing that counsel he's complimenting himself and insulting himself do we take the insult and move the compliment you remind mm. them of who they were but you're also later in your life yeah that doesn't count <laughs> they no he reminds them of what they were scared they would be <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> hey what they could okay have you know what all god gamers that enjoy my Valorant stream sound off all right tell me why you like them and we'll see who's right uh-huh. because I do it for you sure when uh, I but- see magi just pop off after like three hours of streaming and she just goes let's go i'm like 
at the at the after party i see magi and bonfire they're both giggling like schoolgirls, <laughs> and, and i go over and i'm like what's going on what's what's so funny and magi's like freaking out and i'm like what's what's up and she's like the guy who FC'd through the fire and flames for the first time is here. Oh my god! <laughs> I was like, that's so I was hype. like, that's not what I thought you were talking about. Them out is so fucking. <laughs> that's not what that I thought you were talking about. Adorable. <laughs> Bonfire also fan. Uh, what were you saying though? You you were roped off like an animal. Three You're a cow, types of people. A huge just, cow. A huge. Well, just eating and eating and eating. Yeah. And Two hundred pound. Well, it, a stinky two. But stop it. <laughs> and then you're just so big are and bulbous. Are you a stinky two again? No, I'm not even close. Bro, what are you weighing? I'm like one eighty eight. You're not one eighty eight. I am. I want to see you on this scale. You, well, I had a lot of pizza today. You did. Yesterday. I saw you eat it while you were climbing a ladder, <laughs> like, a like a weird a, fireman. I eat like a garbage man at Genesis every day. Food in San Jose is fucking horrible. By the way, I don't know if you guys what? noticed this. There's no, like a million it's, restaurants. It's good. No, it's not. There's like so many restaurants. It's better than Oakland. I disagree. It's better than that oh. part of Oakland. No, it's not because they, Oakland has that that restaurant nature, which is the best food I've ever. Yeah, had. Yeah, the chicken place oh, that okay. gave me feelings. This place is fucking amazing. <laughs> I think you just didn't try enough places. Dude, no, okay, hold on. Aiden can counter this with one point that I gave him earlier, but you're gonna shut up and you're not gonna say anything. Shut the fuck uh, up, J Mook, uh, wearer I, of a <laughs> shirt guy. Uh, I I ate a lot of different food. Idiot. Okay. <laughs> all right, yeah. all right. and you're is. wrong <laughs> sorry we so, keep wait, interrupting i'm not allowed to wait, tell them he, that you he, ate at the same mexican place twice in one day that happened wow but there was many there's, days there's only so many <laughs> meals wow. there was many days so i mean i feel like you blew i a think meal there, i think always saying the food in x place sucks if it's a city like a city populated area it's like you just you just I went ate, to the wrong spot I by ate, accident i it's ate okay. five restaurants Look, I were will, all, I will you say five that. restaurants, two were the same. One is Original Joe's, which is not a good place. And then it was also Easter. Six restaurants. Someone ordered spaghetti at that fucking dinner. Who was ordering spaghetti oh, and meatballs? There's a few side spaghettis. I ordered just meatballs. Oh, it was an Italian place, right? It was an Italian Never place. Never mind. Wait, are you talking about the place we got dinner? Original Joe's, I thought yeah. they were that pulling place was a David Chong. Good. No, no. David was, Chong used to go to Denny's and order spaghetti. This was an Italian place. You're supposed to maybe okay, get spaghetti. Yeah. It was decent. Anyway. You're a fat, you're a giant cow roped off. You keep saying, this is why we get derailed. You're like, you're like Archdeacon, <laughs> Archdeacon from why the Deep. Why do we get derailed? From Dark Souls 3. Yeah. And there's, and, and I can give you dregs, human dregs, yeah. and then you give me lore, and, and, I, and if, I can do PvP with it. If you could tip it. them, you got everything in the mashing cup. <laughs> so yeah, I'm in the pen. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I ate like a garbage man, really quick. Sorry, I ate like a garbage man, <laughs> and I got home, and I was like, no, and I, and I was like, I'm gonna kill myself. I was like, well, I'm I just didn't, didn't finish my point. So. I'm just gonna so kill I, you. I got you home, had three points. I didn't finish my point. So I got home, and I was like, damn, I feel fucking gross and big and huge and gross. And I got on the scale, and I'm the lightest I've ever been. Yeah. And I realized that the way you feel means too. nothing. No, well, no, I'm not the slowest I've ever been. <laughs> Slow than me. I'm not put a big old slop trough. <laughs> Hey, hey, dude, it was just it was like the yeah, slurm this, bucket I, from Futurama. C nine slop and, drop. Dude, he couldn't he couldn't go anywhere without dragging it, yeah. and it's just scraping so, the concrete. <laughs> it's like, and he can't because he needs to eat the slop that's while why, while he mashes while he that's talks. That's why to people. so many people stopped about his way out because he was dragging it out. Yeah, him. he wasn't like, moving very fast. <laughs> and when the slop was out, he just he just wailed like a banshee. Like, just scream to the stars. Like, how could this have happened to Your me? Your face and shirt just covered in slop. <laughs> slop and gruel. <laughs> and creamed corn. No, but what were you saying? It was fun. <laughs> <laughs> it was nice meeting everyone. <laughs> and then and you're just wheezing and wheezing. Hope everyone had a good time. <laughs> hey, uh... So about... We can go back to old enough. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you watched it with Mango. Yeah, it was, good. it was also good. I I went out to dinner with uh, Hassan and Cutie and a few other people last week, and Hassan was uh, and uh, Hassan and somebody else were talking about the show at dinner, but that uh, and they were just gassing up the show because talking uh, about the yard. No, 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 old enough because oh! we're all we're all watching the, the Japanese uh, kids. You I know? see, I see, yeah. Uh huh. And I'd heard about this show from uh. Zipper three too, who was also also at the dinner. So I was like, oh yeah, this is uh, maybe maybe it's time to get around to watching this. And then while we're at dinner, the conversation breaks away from this into uh, slime somehow. Slime is the dinner topic, and Hassan starts explaining oh. about how much he loves slime. How you're how you're one of his favorite people because he's seen he's seen who you like follow and interact with on Twitter and he's like we have a bunch of the same interests like he's into all this like niche 
weird stuff that I am, and I really like that guy. Because they're both, and I'm just listening to Hassan <laughs> fucking gas up slime at dinner. Uh, <laughs> off, I don't get this. Fresh, I, I, met, fresh I didn't have friends of, all weekend. Last fresh weekend, fresh off you... of us talking about how how he's the how he's oh. the uh, the risk in the group. Which, <laughs> to be fair, I I thought about it more. I agree. No, yes. yeah. come on. <laughs> Thank you. You have Hassan in your corner, and I'm out. That's yeah. crazy. That's a bad person to have in your corner. Why? Because he's also a risk. How is he a risk? He's a brand risk. Are you kidding me? What? He said one thing about 9-11 one time, maybe more than that. <laughs> yeah. So what? That, you dude, ever, that's it. Dude, there's that one edit. It makes me laugh every single time. Is that clip of Hassan. Uh, it's like, did America deserve 9-11? Yeah, and then it cuts to Robot Rock by Daft Punk. <laughs> and I, I've seen it maybe twenty times. I think it's funny every single it, time. It's like the uh, the YLYL where it's like interracial marriage, cringe. Yeah. And then it's bam, 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 bam. Yeah. I think we we both broke on that. <laughs> one. Yeah, it's a good one. <laughs> uh, yeah, Hassan, Hassan's also a risk, dude. Yeah, but no, he's not because you could have you had Hassan on Mogus Money. I mean, like. He's not listen. He's, I'm fine with it. I don't care. All I'm saying is I am. You already know. He isolates me. Yeah, you're precious, audience bro. You're when precious. He does that. Fucking precious, bro. You're precious and injured and feeble. How was your? In our short time with you left. We I should enjoy. I Mango and Cassidy. It's fucking fucking hype. Everyone's. everyone's I'm a, a good hanger. Everyone's a boomer. I'm a good hanger, huh? Dude, yeah, you're you a great sent, hanger. You sent another weird room tour video of me <laughs> with Mango. Yeah, that was awesome. Yeah, we all laughed at that. <laughs> yeah. Thing. I did. It wasn't. It wasn't as funny as it could have been. So I didn't like Mango post broke. it. Post it. Yeah, yeah. Mango broke. broke. Yeah. But uh, I was like, "What's up? I'm here with the goat Mango. I'm walking through Aiden's room, and then I'm like, "Yo, what's up, hey, Mango? You think this guy has sex, or like, what do you think about this person who lives in here?" And uh, he's like, "Why is this monitor on a Wii box? Which is true. Uh, your computer monitor is." And then we're all looking around, and then he looks down. He's like, "Oh, there's condoms. There's condoms on your floor." Yeah. And that's hype. I took took them out. Before well, yeah, you started. Trip. You started I using. I put them on them. my fingers and I played play yeah, them for I, a little bit. I play. I play this little game when I'm alone. is called condom fingers. And I fucking <laughs> waggle them around. I, I chase myself. And I the draw. Road. I, and I take a sharpening. I draw little faces on each one. It's like a little show. I and then I do it in front of my mirror. I want to. Yeah, it's it's uh, Harry Potter puppet pals. What was it like being? <laughs> uh, what was it like being an insect? Ugh. What was uh -oh. your What was your weekend? Like? Ah, shit. What can What can I say? I'm still in extreme pain. Uh, I what happened? What happened? What happened? Uh, so the, the story goes. I, trigger, I triggered a part of his brain he can't control. Literally, month, <laughs> literally like a month ago. This is sleep I, and I, I think a lot about it. I think it's because I was like fucking playing video games for like nine hours straight for three, four days in a row, and my posture is shit. Anyway, I wake up one morning and I turn my head. Oop! I got a. I pinched something right there just by turning my head, which is really annoying because like, well, I turn my head a lot in life, and then. <laughs> Uh, it was right after I woke up. So either way, it's like, oh, that hurts. Now I can't do it. I can't exercise. Can't work out. I can't be active because it's like it's it's a little tender. It's not like debilitating, but I got to stay off it because I know what happened last time. I know what happened last time. I worked out and then it fucking just like, <clears throat> and then it was like three weeks later. I'm like, it feels better, but it wasn't fixed. And then I did work out. Oh, two days later, mm. it was. It's just the most insane pain. It's like a nerve that runs from your neck to your shoulder to your uh, tricep. Oh, I, do I, the spine stuff fucking blows because it's just your whole body. It, your toes will not work or something. Yeah, it's you're just like, like oh, uh, cool. guess what? It's like it's like a butterfly effect type beat. And uh, and so, yeah, I'm just in extreme pain. It's been getting a little bit better by day by day. But basically, I just have to sit on my back. I couldn't like I can't sit down very easily. Like my posture here is the only comfortable way I can be. Dude, I was ordering like tacos at the place down the street and I'm like, st I can't stand. I have to like do this and kind of like walk around like an asshole or like a gibbon. <laughs> like I was going to say like yeah, a gibbon. I'm just yeah. like a gibbon. <laughs> and the, the girl who's like taking my order, she's like kind of looking at me. Like, what is he doing? I look what? like I'm trying to flex so and I'm just like you, being really weird. Why are you like a gibbon? It fucking <laughs> sucks. I can't even like go in public because I'm just like in pain. Anyway, yeah. So I was just like on my back and I watched uh, Genesis and I played Elden Ring. I have like 50 hours in Elden Ring. And you watched Jamie change the game. Watch Jamie Wait, and it's wanna, the best game ever made, go by the way. I want to go to bat for slime right now. What's up? I have something I want to go to bat for. Well, first of all, you dodged a bullet not going to Genesis. What? Yeah, I just got, I got FOMO on Sunday night. No, you want to know about it. have fun. You dodged one single bullet in a flurry of cookies that you could have eaten. Was it a real bullet from a gun? Was, from a gunman? <laughs> mm -hmm. Kind of. 
uh, one of your round one pools matches was with someone who's banned in your chat, <laughs> and they wanted to talk to you and they wanted to tell you that they were banned. Oh uh, well, that could have been hype because I could have beat them. You could have beat them. It only room. matters if I beat them. I yeah, maybe that would made you feel good. Um, but also, I could have been like, look, if you beat me, you're unbanned. But this is the part where uh, I want to go to bat for you because I think that you were criminally underseated. I think that I think <laughs> yeah. that you were so underseated. Is polite was two seeds over you. You had to beat polite to make it out of pools, before, and then polite had to like beat someone else. Well, I heard pools are really light this this year. Well, it was only light because of DQs. Right, it wasn't light in general. Like like there's a lot of the top seeds just didn't show up. But polite was seated above you. You had, <laughs> you had to beat polite, and I was like, oh, yeah. is polite fucking dude. Tight no, and look, no, no, no. no and no. I I played polite because I was interested. I was like, polite. I was, 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 was play? Plays fox. Okay. And uh, you're just, better than polite. I'm better than polite. You're better than polite. Look, I lost to blur. You got it, you know, but you made it. You no, made no, it no, outlast no, no, Genesis. No, no, no. Here's, here's you made the, it outlast uh, Genesis. Uh, they received the dark secret. Through. The dark secret is that Blur is actually decent. No. Yeah. Yeah. The thing especially, is, especially, especially if fast Blur work. was to get like, if Blur was to go on a JMook run, people would still say Blur sucks. Yeah. Don't you get it? Blur yeah, does I, suck. I can't. Yeah. See, like I can't. I'm saying that because I money matched him. There's a video on my channel still. When? Like, when? When? 2018. Yeah. It's like it's seven thousand years ago. Maybe. Yeah, he think. got. He All I'm got saying better. is, no way. It, Blur's no, really good now, but you can't. That's not. That's no excuse for losing to Blur. <laughs> if that makes sense. He's not a lot of. Yeah. So, His skill increasing is the skill floor increasing. And also right, melee stats. Right. Melee stats does not like me very much. It's pretty much Wheat who loves me, and then everyone else they're beefing with me. So, it's all right. I, look, Genesis staff. I'm trying to take down the system from the inside, and it's mm -hmm. a it's a lone battle. There's a lot of cabals, a lot of terrorism. The melee stats cabal. Yo, speaking of terrorism, <gasps> we can't do this again. <laughs> I love our adderies. Do they? Do they? They? Do they, they, they well, I don't okay, know. I don't know about. I don't know about the sponsors, I but the I fans know. loved it last episode. I mean, the sponsors are signing off on them, though, right? Yeah. There you go. We're gonna sign off. Well, on. how about you sign off on this? Wait, should we do it? I mean, we can do it later. We we'll do, do it later. We'll do it later. later. <laughs> I just, I've, I actually went to look at, I almost never watch Yard after we do it, but I went to watch last week's episode because I wanted to see her ad read. Did, you, did yeah. you read the comments? Yeah. 90% yeah. of comments are talking about the ad read. 90% of the comments are talking about how we're demonetized and how they want ads on the video. Yeah, that's very hype, So guys. that we can have monetization. We appreciate that. I wish the other one could have been And they're cut. right. We're not making enough. God damn it. Thank you, boys, for fighting. I want to know what that... Thanks for 20. <laughs> I want to know what that person was banned for. Because if it was like something stupid... I know, I know. It'd be like whatever. They were banned for you playing Valorant and them going in chat and saying Counter-Strike is better. Mm. Yeah, I, I, I think I would have talked to that person like a normal human being. Okay. And and I think that would have been fun. You changed. So, Your so back yeah, changed. No, I, I just... The thing, the, thing, the thing is, I just don't... The acidity, it's like if they come up to me, even if they're banned or something, and they're like just really normal, and they're not like a fucking cartoon... I'm like I'm I'm ninety percent just gonna be like yeah. All right. Wait, is oh, this, you know is what? This the guy that came nope. up to us at the end Different, of the event. This guy was very normal, but that this this is important. We we told him we would tell you, and yeah. we'll do it here uh -oh. in public. We uh, will air it. <laughs> so someone that you banned, weapon, uh, uh, asked us for forgiveness because you rejected their forgiveness. Uh, and that's came, so hype. And you came, blocked, and came up to us pleading. That sentence you is blocked hype him to on me. Twitter. You blocked him on Twitter, and we're like. Yeah, we can't help you with that. Oh, like I know who it is. I've been blocked on Twitter, and then he said he sent you an apology on Twitch, like a Twitch whisper, and and you said something to the effect of "I don't believe that you mean it," and then he expressed to us that he would like you to know that he really <laughs> well, does. No, the words. This no, no, is the, so stupid. The words he used were, "I think he just doesn't know I'm from Toronto." And he doesn't know that this is genuine oh, words. Vancouver, Vancouver, or Vancouver. Don't let Ontario take credit Sorry, for this. Can Vancouver. I ask what? BC, like, like, why like, are you doing this? Because yes, Canadian. Huh? Can, no. why, why give him this? Why because it was no, his one he wish. was genuinely was trying to wish. apologize. He had. He said, said I had one wish. He's Canadian. He it's he in felt, our soul. He, said he felt really bad about. It's what he in said our to soul you. to apologize. Well, if he felt that bad, then he should just fucking. Oh man, this is bad. Oh no. Wait, if he felt that bad, how dare he do this? We're making it worse. How dare he do this? Because if it was that <laughs> yeah. bad, your job is no, to just leave me alone. Hold on, hold on. He's doing it, it to you. It he's wasn't that bad. He's doing it to you. He's right. Yes. He's taking a podcast time. He's taking a podcast time. You're taking up time. We're making a million doctors and you're taking up our time. What the fuck? I can't remember what he said, but he explained what you blocked him for and it really was not bad. Like, oh yeah, yeah. It was fine. Oh, he, I think he said he wanted to like crack an egg on your head or something. Oh, oh that's what it was. He wanted to kiss your head. Kiss, kiss top your, your head. head. Let, you know what? Something like that. Let me let me bring this up. 
Just stop fucking messaging me fucking things that you think oh. I would think are funny. I'm oh. not your friend. And I don't mean that like a dickhead. You, did, you just I'm said like, it. Just send it to your own friends. And if you don't have them, I just please don't make it my problem. You just I don't said, care. You just said it. You just said Look, why would you do that? Look, get more. I remember your no, name. No, 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 no. I, I think wanna... I think because I've been blocking so many people, I'm I'm close to the utopia. I have to believe or that. Or it'll be a thing where I get one and it's You'll like Slime said I can't message him anymore. All, so I'm, all I'm saying you. is, guys, it's just weird. <laughs> I, so I look at it and I'm like, this is just weird. Dude, I'll be your friend. You guys can DM me. Yeah, DM Ludwig. He doesn't care. Ugh, he'll just ignore it because he's fucking goaded at the sauce and I'm, bussing I'm, I down. I love me. It's, it's, like, it's like trying to send a fucking text to a dog or like a toaster. Hey, hey. it won't go. Oh, uh, fuck me. Hey, Reed. Blackard, we so tried. I don't, yeah. Yeah, That's suck my dick, dude. Leave me alone. <laughs> no, don't, I don't care. D- don't suck his dick. Don't Speaking do that. Speaking of excluding Aiden from things that we all get to do. Nice. All right. Well, let's go. Everyone here except for Aiden. Is gonna be in Mogul Money Live. Let's go. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Super clap too, dude. I, I I can't believe this because is it because he doesn't like Fortnite? The reason no, no the reason cause... that I'm not in is because I threw I threw the game because I didn't know that oh, having a lead going into fast money is fucking oh so you just didn't, mattered. It's like whatever. It's just a game, bro. That's I, what you're I saying. Be no, you're a troll. So. I don't think that it should this be on me to make you think the game is important and take the care and respect that it deserved. I got and now you're mad that you don't get a reward for not giving no, the game respect. No, I don't saying, know why this I, is on me. It's it's That's funny crazy. that he as he is getting he is getting. Wait, did you announce this as why? one of the people? Huh? Have you announced? No, this is a he is joining is well actually just one competitor can't join, so he is joining because of that. But I haven't though. That's a secret one. But Nick is joining because he's a champion. He's a and champion. Deserves oh, yeah, he's a I would have been if I didn't bet Nick, all my Slime points. Slime is part of a secret. You also one, which didn't I don't win leaking. five thousand dollars. I know, but like you didn't care about that. No, I did care about that. I'm telling you, you said that you threw, I didn't so you didn't care rules. that much. But you no, said you threw. I didn't throw on purpose. I. It's like you're not even listening. Dude, you're doing thing, me right now. I'm just saying I thought right you, now. You, when you you're say you throw. So you're, you're, Aiden, you're Aiden pilled right now. I, yes, I, it happens all the time. Can I try? Of course. Let me try rephrasing like Michael Barbaro. Um, so yeah, I, I, I guess I was just invited to a game show and I didn't like look up the rules at all. And, and then after mm. that I lost, mm. it, I, it, not understanding the rules, I'm mm. upset because now I found out about the rules mm. even though I could have looked it up. Michael Barbaro mm. doesn't sound anything like hey, this. Bitch, yes. And also, <laughs> also, isn't it your job to explain the rules? No. Wait, he did. Wait, no, no, I will say, Lud- yeah, Ludwig, uh, there were a couple... I explained how to explain play the game. The lead I don't explain... You didn't explain that <laughs> the lead how to play the game. I knew him. If there's negative there numbers... the game. There if you you're go. second going into Fast Money, you lose, Not true. basically. Not I true. Would, I wouldn't be second. Saikuno Connery's pants, <laughs> episode six. Mm, didn't know about that, yeah, did you? only if the person going first is... Terrible. It's crazy how fake you are. You've oh never watched God. an episode and you're complaining about the show for me. I have. I watched all the episodes. Then why didn't you know how it worked? Ooh. Ooh. She Do you ever forgot? think about that? Oh. Mm. Oh, forgot? Whose like, fault is it? Mm. Who forgot? Oh, it's you? You forget to flush after shit and is that my fault too? You send the rules to Hassan If Zipper 3 Cody says Cole, a, sees a fucking meatloaf me. in the toilet. Actually, I love this shit. Are you what, high not, right now? Actually, you didn't want... You did it and they... D- d- oh. Play the Phoenix Wright music. Because you said that I sent the rules to Cody... The rules to Cody Cole. I sent Cody to look up Valorant agents because it was going to be yeah. in the quick money. So why didn't he help me? And he didn't do it. Yeah. So you That's didn't even different. watch. It That's doesn't different. even matter. It's like... No, uh, I knew that happened. I'm I knew that he... I'm telling the people that you took the time to send them to Cody Cole. You didn't send anything to me. You know what was a big clip? Uh-huh. The fucking the I so I, I messaged Radstads and I was like let's let's take a page out of Limus's book. Oh, oh by the way, that's why Luke has been on the board for fucking two weeks. Limus tech tips, okay. Linus, <laughs> Linus tech tips. Linus, for those. Linus text my tip. So he <laughs> that was someone's name. By the way, Discord. Uh, they they do uh, they have a WAN show. It's called the WAN show. It's with Luke and Linus. And it's like a just a tech podcast, and they'll they have <laughs> WAN show clips, and it's a huge fucking <laughs> channel. <laughs> oh, you want to take? Yeah. Don't start, don't start, don't start laughing at me about what I watch on my dude. fucking personal time, dude. I'll dude, walk into his dude room. he's gonna fucking roast he's me. Sitting there like his dumbass position, like a Family Guy character who tripped over, <laughs> <laughs> and he's watching Linus Tech Tips. No, 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 it's not. It was Gamers uh, Nexus. It's, he's watching a video, and it's a list. And it's like AMD 740, AMD 730. Yeah, dude. <laughs> okay. Uh, Intel hey, 550. Every, hey, and it's a my, my loyal brothers of Steve from Gamers Nexus rise and tell Ludwig he's fucking stupid. It's, it's a review of a bunch of what? Processors. processors. 
and how fast they go. No, they do temperature. They do oh ambient. My God. They do case torture. And he, and they do like, they, they do for FPS in, in Red Dead 1440p. He's like 17 minutes into this like 30 minute video, and it's just like an Excel sheet. Basically. I'm an ex- I'm a, an insanely informed consumer. You have no fucking idea. That's great. Yeah. That yeah but great. he walks in and literally the content on these videos is like a series of charts and Steve talking over them and explaining them very succinct. He's she's so goaded. He's actually a journalist. And and <laughs> and what walks in and it's just journalist. a video of charts and I'm just watching it and it he looks at me so dry yeah dude yeah. no, no way. This, is, this is the most boring thing we've ever brought on the screen no no I dude I watch these all the time it yeah. is so boring. It was he, actually that video, Zipper. Isn't that crazy? You're yeah. watching that. He's watching. He's yeah. like halfway So that's why through. when you fucking dipshits ask me about your computers, yeah. I have the fucking answer every yeah. time. No, I love that. That's you, right. You guys helped build you, my PC. And but I didn't, I didn't oh, this is a great chart. <laughs> See, so frequency variation. This is great. Look at how slow the yellow line moves. Stop why laughing, so, Zipper. <laughs> why is he so slow? Anyway. Yeah, oh, this is the chart you oh, walked in on. Whoa. This is, this is your chart. Yeah. So this is power consumption. Now you can see here that when you get down, bigger. So that that this 3D uh, 5800 processor is really good for gaming, yeah. but not for like editing and stuff. It's cr- it's so it's so crazy how good you are at dating. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty charming, huh? You're, Isn't that crazy? So, it's so annoying that that you are that charming on like Tinder, and, but also watch videos like that. What can I say? I'm 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 a bit of an all star. I mean that's pick, that's pick like, one. That's dad <laughs> behavior. That just means he's fertile. It means he's ready. Yeah, wow. he's ready, dude. I, yeah. I am. I'm in my dad phase. I watch documentaries. I fucking watch chart videos. I bet your boys are plump. And I got plump boys. And I'm fucking. It's great. I got a look now. I'm gonna just dress like this all the time. I don't like that. This is Miles' shirt. No, you know I don't I know that. You, you know I thought that. about this recently. You have, you have a you have a best look that you that you've done mm. that you've that, like. That you mean I've peaked. You've had you have a look that I think that was your best look. Ooh, well, yeah, let's see it's if when we I agree. It's hair. not a peak. It's just this is how you achieve your true agree. potential. All right, Wait, what'd you say? I think your best look was Ludwig's birthday dinner. Oh, <gasps> really? Yes. By far, this was my top two. Really? You had the open the open button down with the rose tinted shades. Oh, true. Yeah, you mm-hmm. looked good. Yeah, my ex girlfriend dressed me. Is why you looked fucking yeah, sick. That's why Italy Slav was also great. I liked Slav st- status. It's too funny. I don't yeah, think yeah. It's, it's like more. It's, it's more of a bit than than true. like a look. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I fucking. I. I guess I don't care enough. Think that look. At B, when I worked at BTS, it was lights out because I. It was like you could wear whatever you wanted. So I would just do. There's a picture. Have you seen this? I think I showed Ludwig. It's Dan and me, and it's at my old <laughs> desk, standing my old standing desk, which was just like a bunch of things piled up to make it taller. You used to have a desk that was made of cardboard boxes. Yeah, because I wanted to stand, and Dan's next to me, and he's like, he's like touching his nipples, and I'm standing there, and I got like my shit hair, and I got like my gut out, and it's like, I, it's, it, I think like Dakota took the picture, dude, I look fat. It's, it's, a, it's the worst I've ever looked in my in my life, and that's what I look like that sometimes, and I'm like, damn, I have definitely had sex before. That's crazy. <laughs> I think. The other look I was thinking of is when you rock the, uh, when you have the aviators and that jean jacket with the, mm, yeah, uh, yeah, the little mink, the fake, the, it's like fake mink. Yeah. 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 Everything is from my ex-girlfriend that she bought me. Yeah. yeah. All great stuff. Oh, yeah. I, have, I can't dress myself. That's how it works. I have, I have Prezzo lore. I, yeah. le- I learned Prezzo lore. <gasps> Cause I hung out with, uh, uh, Phil. Yeah. Soup Ostrich, Soup Ostrich like, was there. a lot. Mm-hmm. Um, and, Crazy uh, crossover. Okay. So speaking of very, very funny thing on Sunday is polite and we we went and got like basically like a mogul moves dinner like all of the full-time employees that were there which was a lot it was like most of the company yeah gang um, rolls deep went out to a uh, dinner on saturday night and uh polite and rad stads and shake were talking about how tomorrow morning soup ostrich phil is going to take them out shopping because Phil is like just a fashion savant, a stylist, oh. yeah, and and literally wants to work in like the fashion industry. As a he's stylist. a he's a fitum girl. We come out of top eight because we hadn't seen them yet, and they're all fitted as fuck. <laughs> they all look so good. That's crazy. And I'm like, damn, they look so oh, much the, better. This is the matching red Nikes than they did yesterday. Right. I was like, Yo, you all look so amazing right now. Really? And then I remembered that Phil like handcrafted outfits for them all. Wow. And it all made a lot more sense. Uh, so the Mogul Mo- Moves boys all got 
tripped out by Soup Ostrich. And the, and the reason for Phil, the reason me and Phil gravitated towards each other is because of Prezzo. We both because we both love Prezzo. Soup Ostrich has been a, a melee like uh, a Twitch monster for a long time. Yeah, that's how I know this person. And I learned mm. so much about him and how much Twitch he watches, which is so much. And uh, I was like, "How do you meet Prezzo?" And uh, so Phil was telling me that you know how Prezzo has the deer profile picture. Yeah. The reason Prezzo has that profile picture is because when Phil met Prezzo, Phil was like, oh, this is like, like, Prezzo like, is like, cute, I want to like be friends with this person, and like was talking to him, and said, hey, why do you like look so bad in your profile picture? And Prezzo got so self-conscious about the profile picture of his face that he changed it. And oh, that no. was where the deer was born. That's so sad. Was hiding oh. his face because Phil cyberbullied him. The deer him. is a mask. <laughs> wow. The deer hides the deer how is he a, feels. It's a dream mask. <laughs> the, the headlights are Phil's hurtful words. And I, and I was like, wow. "That's fucked up." That what you said is fucked up. Yeah. Yeah. That. Uh, and then, uh, yeah, so I learned that lore. Well, I remember when I said good. when I didn't like Prezzo because he was always mean to Ludwig in chat. I hated him. I was like, this guy's a dick. Mm -hmm. I didn't know Prezzo was a jokester. I was, I was trying to tell you. Yeah, and then and then I said that in the, it was during the subathon. I said it when we were in the kitchen streaming. I was like, fuck you, Prezzo. Do not talk to me. If you're fucking mean to Ludwig. I do not like you. It really hurt him. And then I was like, oh, no. Wait a minute. <laughs> and, then, and then I found out that Prezzo is a delight. And that's called character growth. Mm -hmm. For you mm -hmm. or him? Him. Of <laughs> right. No, of course, yeah. Because yeah, you're Max. Me and Phil. The reason I was so tired today is uh, me and Phil all nightered. We just like hung out all night, <laughs> and then uh, we got coffee back in the morning. So late. I came back so late, and you guys were up talking. And then I, I it's like five thirty when I get back to the room. I immediately go back to bed, and then I wake up two hours later at like seven thirty to go to bed to go to the bathroom. They're still up talking. You're still having like the same conversation. We got coffee. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> it was seven. Uh, but anyway, I I went to bed when I got home. I went to, like I took a nap when I got back. Um, but I asked Phil because we were talking so much about like fashion and stuff. I was like, so what do you think? What are your your notes on me? Because you keep pulling out, you keep saying what you thought about everyone you saw. Like you obviously formed an opinion mm -hmm. about me. Like what are your and look, I didn't look. I wasn't putting in like that much effort. Genesis. I was like coming with a nice hoodie yeah, I like or something. I want to be comfortable. And Phil was like, you're safe. That's like, right. Safe. And I was like, that's right. That's why I, you wear all black. But I was mm -hmm. like, that's why you wear black. You know be, what you're doing. I be safe. I be safe. You are safe. I be safe. I'm I'm black, like, I'm I'm like. You've never worn a color in your life except shorts that one time. I'm like, I'm fucking, I'm gonna go try it. I'm fucking feel bad. It's chicken a little bit. Feel bad. I'm gonna go try. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're gonna have to throw out all your black clothes. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta be bold. You gotta wear some something the, you care about. The mook. That's what I'm talking the about. That shirt about. was made by Etost, by the way. <laughs> who, uh, I met for the first time because he came up to me and he was the world's drunkest man. <laughs> yeah. He came up to me. There was a carnival barker yeah. just pointing at him, <laughs> he, charging you money. He actually Come came up to me. <laughs> it's been three years. <laughs> so Etos talks pretty quickly. Yeah. Uh, people who know him know this. And uh, comes up and puts his hand on my shoulder and actually goes, and I was like, I start, I start busting up laughing because I'm like, dude, holy shit. <laughs> so you're a sim. And I look at him and I say, I've never met someone as drunk as you ever. You are the most drunk really? person I have ever Even seen. Even Eric? It was fucked. Eric was drunk too. He, he was fucked up. Dude, that's crazy. And I was like, I just started laughing because I'm like, holy shit, you are the drunkest person ever. And he's trying to like, he's, he keeps telling me to shut up. Cause I'm, cause yeah. I'm, but, but he's he, right. Like, but he can't form words. And I'm like, holy! I can't get any worse. And I'm just laughing and running away from him because I'm scared. He, he tossed he the biggest grinder for uh, Mogul Money. Yeah. yeah, he did write a lot of the questions. A lot, a lot questions. of them were dog shit. Yeah, but he tries a lot. He tries harder than anyone I know. And that's beautiful. And so sometimes I put some in, even though I'm like. It's not the greatest he tossed, but you tried. You have to explain to Pokemon, look, he tried really hard. <laughs> so that's why we're doing a category on words that have come, but also piss. <laughs> he took, oh, but, wait, sorry, go ahead. Oh, I was just going to say, I like the initiative he took because he had this idea on Saturday after Mook beat Laud. He was like, dude, what if like, what if I got a bunch of blank t-shirts and, and made like a bunch of t-shirts for everybody? I was just like, yeah, that would be you sick. You just like that you got a free shirt. Dude, I... Uh, no, he made like... I think it's cool that he took the time <laughs> to fucking make like you 30 pay him? of them. You pay him for his work? You exploit him? Yeah, exploit him. You, you would have uh, loved me in college because no. I, would, I would buy blank white hats and then write on them with marker dude. and just write things. Mm -hmm. And I had... One of them said horse party and these girls in my uh, class for my final like paper where we peer reviewed each other's like research papers, yeah. they all wrote... They all drew different variations of what they thought a horse party was on my paper. 
That's it, cute. It was very cute. Yeah, I was I, a, I was a hit. I got I forgot about it. I got stun locked by a French melee player. I was at the venue Ugh. at four a.m. Hate to see and that. not not in per, on the setup. Was it Raul? No, Long hair? no, 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 no. It wasn't number. It wasn't number one. I didn't recognize uh, them. You play um, like a, a, a pussy. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I'm on a setup, and I'm playing. Um, no I'm fashion. playing Peach versus someone mm -hmm. um, who's like a yard listener, and a person comes up and doesn't really speak any English besides like melee stuff. Um, and so uh, they sat down, and uh, they like they unroll and they plug in, and then uh, I beat the person. I go to play this person, and I I, I switch to Falco because they're Marth. I don't want to play Peach Marth. And uh, he looks over at me, and he goes. Peach, <laughs> and he points to the screen. And goes Peach, and I'm like, oh, I I play Falco too. Like Falco's my main character, and uh, he looks back at me, and he like shakes his head and looks back at the screen. And I was like, oh, okay, play the game, win the game, go back on the rotation, come back, and he look, he goes, Peach now, <laughs> and I was like, oh, oh, oh okay, and I switched to Peach, and I, I just like the other guy was like, oh, I just, I just played this French player with Peach Marth for like an hour. Yeah, you, he forced <laughs> just, you into it. He just forced me into it. I was just stuck there. I'm like, oh, this was is he weird. mad? I don't think Were so. Were you winning? I just think, yeah, I don't lose that's the game. Why, but that's Europeans, why. Europeans just get to the point. Yeah, <laughs> but, but, they know I know. what they want. But I just think he didn't have like the words to say that he wanted me to play Peach. He wanted the practice. That's probably why he sat down. Yeah. But it was funny because it came off as very cold because all he could tell me was Peach and a point. Yeah, he could just peach. demand it. Like demand a what he wanted me to do. Wait, could you what tell does the Peach difference? mean in French? Uh, Like actually pussy. Could you <laughs> tell the difference between a French person and a Quebecois? I could. Like, is that from someone from Canada? Or yeah. from Quebec? Uh. Maybe no. It's, I think, it's actually the serpent god that the Aztecs. I, I don't know if I could pinpoint like right now. We should do that. That's what? a Ludwig video. Lo put put oh. them, but it's it's in the dark. Wait, why? You to, and you, you have to feel their bodies. Feel their bodies. Yeah. <laughs> See which one has more slime and sweat and on them. And then you like grab their penis and they're like, ooh, and you're like French. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where does the question come from? And huh? then you grab you grab the Quebecois. It's like, dude, 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 dude. I was because I, I you were saying he's French and I just didn't know if he's French or Quebecois. It's I mean, No, he said I'm from France. He said I'm and French. He like explained, the, uh, he explained why he wasn't speaking any English. But that's Quebecois. a good yeah. But yeah. like it's always fifty fifty there. Mm. By the way, I, tough spot. We, we deviated. No. So I want to bring this up. So the I told her at I was like, let's steal from Limus tech tips okay and oh, let's right. do really long clips because their clips are like 13 minutes and they're like they pop off pretty well so uh rats had started doing longer segments where we have like whole things and one of them was um the the shotgun story where you, you took shotgun from yeah. ludwig like a fight like it was crazy and i rewatched it i watched it as content and i was like man this guy sucks like i can't believe he did that to that guy <laughs> and then <laughs> it was, I was like, it was nice to see it as a viewer Dude, would. So many of those comments were like these grown men calling shotgun. Oh, also, someone was like, Nick, what, Nick always has to lie about stories. And I actually responded to that. I'm like, you're so fucking stupid. Anyway, so <laughs> I, I'm bringing Hell that yeah. up because it's a segue into Luke from Linus Tech Tips. By the way, I've been watching fucking tech videos since before wow. you were out of high school. Really? Yeah, that's <laughs> how cool like, I am. The difference between floppy disk speeds? I've been watching, I've been watching Linus for a long time. That's and great. One of my favorite videos is <laughs> Making about, the computer not a room size. It's about a graphics <laughs> yeah. card. So they've just announced the... Uh, uh, the four gigabyte SDXC card. Okay, I'm not. I'm not kidding. <laughs> the new Xerox our computer. The hard drive when our home computer when I was like eight was 12 gigabytes. How to, uh, isn't that crazy? How to clean your rollerball and your mouse? <laughs> Dude, I did have to do that. I'm not kidding. No, because it it, it it it. So it's like there's four rollers and one line of dust gets in yeah, there. You gotta and scrape and you gotta it. Scrape it's it. really satisfying. Yeah, yeah. I, I had to do it too. Yeah, I did. All yeah, right, so. Sure. So Luke, so who used to be on a lot of Linus videos, now he like kind of does his own thing, but he does a podcast with Linus. I don't really know how it works. Uh, I, I, <laughs> I tweeted out back in 2017, I'm not gay, but I'd let Luke and Linus uh, from Linus Tech Tips double team me on the roof of a barn. Someone tweets that out right now about me and you. Do you ban him? Uh, yeah. Think about that. Yeah, I do. Think I do about think that. about that. I'm different now. But either way, Luke messages me. Out of the blue. This is a guy I've watched on YouTube for like a long time. I tweeted that thing and he said, it, it was just randomly. Uh, he said, Slime's top 10 salty ice climber moments was my favorite video of 2021 for real though. <laughs> and then he said, the sheer ironclad determination to troll on that level is truly remarkable. A hero of our time. I immediately, because our friend Jerry, who used to TO a, a tournament in mm -hmm. uh, 805, he's in his WoW guild. He's in Luke's WoW guild. So the shit all comes together. I said, did Jerry put you up to this? He said, no. I had no idea you watch, you watch until your recent tweets. And he's talking about the barn one. 
because I retweeted it. <laughs> Here it is. I'm not Gabe Lunas. Like Linus Luke can double team me on the roof of a barn. I love how he reads this and he thinks to himself, "Oh, slime watches." And then he said, <laughs> "He said the barn one is beautiful." I sent it to Linus, <laughs> and I said, "Ellen Feo, no, not the barn." And then I, I had a moment of reflection. I said, "I guess this is what I wanted to happen." Yeah. Right. You when want you sent the that attention. Tweet out. When and you it, wanted him to fuck you, you actually just wanted him to you wanted notice it. you. I just but wanted you just attention. wanted him to give you attention. Yeah. Oh, hello. Spam. <laughs> Large spam man. Don't say that. Bulbous spam I lord. You I just gave you love. Gonna go eat more spam out of the trough. You are broken. I would it, crack he, you. But he said, <laughs> uh, I said, nice to meet you. And he said, I was considering telling you to pick a barn on the WAN show, which is their podcast. So imagine he like turns to the camera. He's like, by the way, slime, pick a barn. Because he showed it to Linus, who I've been watching for ten years, and also like has laughed at this, which is crazy to me. Anyway, this is a bit of like slime realizing that he's a a bit of a larger bear. In Go the on world. their podcasts. Uh, I don't think that'd be very. Come fun. on, kid. You don't think you can keep up? You don't think? You yeah. Oh, I can keep up. You can talk. Oh, I can keep up. I don't think you'd understand processors like that. Maybe is that the problem? I think. Well, I learned they everything start laughing from at him them. for not knowing enough. <laughs> Like, oh my oh, god. You're <laughs> still watching those? You think the AMD i7 gets that much FPS? I know. I fucking know. I'm just saying. It's crazy to say that. No, it's not a graphics, card. It's, it's 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 not a graphics card. it's two processors. AMDs are graphics cards. No, it's a manufacturer. It's so cringy. It is so cringy. AMD manufacturers both processors and graphics cards. I think you are dumb, bro. I hope you die. I hope you eat out of the trough forever and then you <laughs> Wait, die from getting <laughs> too fat out of the trough. It didn't, it didn't. This is for you, bro. <laughs> Sheesh. What's up, baby? Damn. Come my, correct. Mike's not even going to pick that one up, probably. Come correct. You, can add, it, you can add it in post. <laughs> Ar Archie, <laughs> you're going you're gonna to want to boost the this audio. Not fair. This is, I had hangover farts I just, today. I, just, I could have weaponized that. I just that farted right. and turned it in Ames' direction. He goes... <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I, I love the no. fucking... Okay, so I love like this dusty grandma. It's like I'm my, I'm Mango and I'm watching two two shitters. <laughs> this just is go at warfare. It. <laughs> God, Mango's fucking DJ, bro. <laughs> yeah, hung out with him for like whole day yesterday, probably twelve hours. First of all, he's an anxious flyer. I was making him stress. Oh, really? Yeah, because was our flights at like one twenty or something like that, or like one thirty, and and uh, and I was like, yeah, we can get to the airport at like you know twelve thirty, like an hour before. He's like, no, like I like to get there before and sit down and have like a nice meal. What? And I'm like, bro, Aww. just. You go to oh, get I, to the game. He probably likes to go to the bar. Yeah. yeah. But, <laughs> so I was stressing him out, but we do the whole thing. He, we picked up a 12 pack of Michelob Ultra. I, I, I cleaned off. I polished off four. He drank eight and then had, I kid you not, 15 vodka sodas. <laughs> yeah, he had a lot oh. of those. He was, he was. He was complimenting my pour all night and then I ran out of ice. That's how much he had. I poured him one without ice, and he's like, "What is this?" Yeah, and we did run out of ice in the machine that makes it in the fridge. And I, but I was like, "What do you want from me?" And I just gave him the bottle at that point. He, and you know what? He seemed well put together. He's yeah, a he was great. That's it, crazy, dude. He came. I was laying down upstairs because I can't be mobile. And he's like, "What's up? What are you doing?" And he's like, "I just we start talking." And he comes into my room and just sits on my bed. And it reminded me of that video. It's just called "Bear Sits Next to Guy." <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and because he's just sitting there with yeah. a beer in his hand, we're just like talking. And I'm like, this is nice. Like, <laughs> mangoes, mangoes like the grizzly bear. Man. Yeah, <laughs> I love that video. Um, it, yeah, it was fun. It was nice hanging with Cassidy too. Yeah, this is it. Oh, he's oh so cute, fucking, man. That's terrifying. Dude, Dude this so video has 62 scared. million vi views. Yeah, yeah, that's good. This and is like just, good fucking anyone who could look enjoy at him. He's Dude, that bear man. is huge. Dude, bears can fuck you up. He's a kid, man. His face is that, giant. Look at his I would be nose. so fucking scared. He's like a dog. And his little ears. Are you guys team bear or gorilla? I don't want to choose. Oh, like for a fight? Yeah. The oh. bear definitely wins. I think the gorilla. I think the the wow. gorilla has, has wits. Oh my gosh. I don't know my answer. I'm it's team bear. Why am I not the in The bear is myself? so much bigger than the gorilla. It is bigger. Well, pa it's a, is it pound. one of those bears? Like it's a big ass grizzly bear? We're talking grizzly. I was assuming that type wait, of... Wait, I think wait the are, gorilla, we going, are we going the biggest gorilla versus the biggest yes. bear? I yeah. think if the gorilla can punch the bear in the face hard enough, it kills it with its fucking man face. I think it's got to be bear. Bear, bear Dude, and you, have Are claw. you actually think a gorilla can punch Dude, out? Dude, chimps are so much stronger than you'll ever be. Imagine I a gorilla. I am a human. Yep, yeah, imagine a bear. I'm, <laughs> I'm saying like gorillas are... They, bears have claws. claws. Yeah, but you can just dodge those. 
<laughs> okay, the, but, in wait, Slime's on, universe, so, it is a fight where the gorilla dodges a claw and then punch one hit punches. Un, yeah. Have you it's ever like, seen gorillas like look around? Dude, like it's us? like a it's like a Pokemon fight from the anime where somebody just needs to yell like "Dodge that gorilla!" Yeah. and then he, they like jump yeah, out of the way. and then Pikachu just goes to the side. You <laughs> leave. <laughs> Oh, oh, yeah, I have this bit. I, dude, I was, we were hanging out the Discord the other night. I was just fucking, I could not get this, this out because it was so funny to me. But I've been listening to Grant McDonald a lot because he has, he's been putting out a lot of like pro Ukrainian anti Putin songs. <laughs> Grant McDonald, the guy who did Ram Ranch. And so a lot of them are like, yeah, Putin, fucking <laughs> piece of shit. You dictate with hate, fucking homophobic and, church. And just like a random downloaded instrumental yeah download instrumental and the sounds of two men having sex mm -hmm. in you know <laughs> and this is, is all key. overlaid in like probably one single track yeah and um and so i was running this bit where i was like yeah cypher yeah fucking <laughs> cypher <laughs> taking fucking nasty pictures with your fucking camera <laughs> That's great. <laughs> I could not say that line because I was just laughing so you, hard. You and your grape head. Yeah, <laughs> you <laughs> fucking grape head. Yeah. Yeah, brim, long dick brim. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> Make your oh, own. Oh, man. Uh, it, but I don't know if it was like just 4 a.m. Discord vibes or uh, or it was truly, truly goaded. But oh, you goated. kept it going the next day. I still thought it was funny. <laughs> does, he, does he one take Jake, you think? I don't know. Is there a lot that goes into his craft? I think he recorded all of these 17 years ago. I think he got into it. <laughs> he Even the Ukraine, Ukraine ones. Yeah, he knew. He has one for every conflict between every country. He had the up on, he was listening to that like Putin speech to the German assembly in like 2003. And yeah. Like, this guy's going to fuck it up. Yeah, this years is going to get what weird. <laughs> I think it's just like, it's like drinking out of cups, the video with the lizard, where he's just talking about nonsense. Yeah. And because uh, the lore behind that video is he's just scrolling TV and just talking about what he sees. Uh, Graham McDonald just like I don't know turns on his Twitter or something and just scrolls and just says stuff for like four and a half hours well he just says like four lines and then repeats them and then adds reverb yeah <laughs> and he then it's a 13 minute track gets like Apple Daily Mail updates <laughs> and he just like riffs off it there's also <laughs> Halifax Fuck Pig Sean which I believe is Ben's favorite album because you know Halifax what is Mogul Christmas <laughs> oh dude <laughs> dude I had a moment. I'm going, dude. I might, maybe I like accidentally ate some of that the hormone chicken that I had at Genesis years ago that made me cry. It gave you boobs. <laughs> gave me boobs because I'm driving in my car and uh, I, I'm pulling out of like the the spot and I'm like picking music to play. And I had um because I listened to Wendy from Red Velvet sing "All I Want for Christmas Is You." Right. And I was like, oh, I want to listen to the Ludwig version because it's a good version. Right. And <laughs> go true. And so I turn it on. And, Don't tell me you and, sang along. No, well, I, well, the first part. But I, I start listening to this in the car. My friend Ludwig singing Christmas songs. And then I, I th start thinking about this in the context of if Ludwig is dead. And this is like <laughs> how I'm remembering him. <laughs> And I Why? start getting really emotional. I don't know. Because I was just so, <sighs> I was so happy that this existed. I was like, this is so funny. And he's like singing pretty well. And I remember asking XX when this came out. I was like, dude, can Ludwig really fucking sing or is he capping? And XX was like, Ludwig sings with confidence and usually that's all you need. And I was like, okay. Makes and you're sense. getting emotional listening to me sing. And I'm just listening to this. Yeah. And I'm thinking of like. Yeah, Ludwig like dies, and it's like six months later, and like this comes up on my playlist, and I'm just in the car, I'm just like breaking if down. This is all we have, dude. I can't wait. Ignoring, to die. <laughs> ignoring work related uh, things. If me or you, one of us died, which one of them would care less? Uh, Ludwig. You think Ludwig would care less? Yeah, Ludwig cares less. I would care he, more. he doesn't have the you capacity. Aiden, you don't think Aiden would be like, yeah, you know, death's just like normal part of life, and it sucks, but you know what? He would talk. He would walk back a lot of shit. Where he was like, "Yeah, you're dead. It doesn't matter." Because someone would talk shit on me, and then he'd get mad about it. I think I would be. <laughs> well, actually, I don't know. He wouldn't. Because <laughs> if you wouldn't, then that's fucking crazy. If you wouldn't defend my fucking corpse, you've put me in a weird spot. Yeah, here. I fucking know. Huh? I don't think. Just be honest. I don't think anything I've said before stands in opposition to me defending. Defend my legacy, died. Aiden. Yeah, but it's me who's dead. No, that's what I'm saying. Is I, I don't think that anything, I don't think anything that I have said is in opposition to me defending the you know, after the you question. died. Not answering the There's question. There's no question to answer. You're 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 possibly But you're not this, you're like not you're not reassuring me that you would values. defend me. I would defend you. I'd defend you. I would defend you. Would I you? defended you last week while you were alive. 
That's not. That doesn't count. That doesn't count. I would only defend you when you die. <laughs> that's that's that We're good on the shit. other side. All right. That's honor. Both of you, I, I wait for you to die, and that's you when die. I show my love. He looks at Saikuno, and he's like, he was. Right. I die. <laughs> Ludwig's Ludwig like, yeah, fucking bummer. Yeah, exactly. Oh, no, Nick and dies. That's okay. I'm sad. First thing, I, hey. first person I call is Carl Jacobs, and I say I love that man. <laughs> and he's dead. Carl, now. Nick, <laughs> the only man I've ever loved. Nick dies, and you're like, uh, I guess I just got to climb with a track now. Well, you just uh, like I was gonna ask him to climb today. Eh. That'd be hard, bro. <laughs> I'll go. Ludwig would be sad, but he can't. He doesn't have the RAM. He only has so much no, RAM. I do. Oh, I, no, I get you, sad you when people die. This, you, you talked about this a, in the, a I get few really months sad. ago. No, don't you're die. Like, you're so you're sexy. Like, if, Nick, <laughs> if Nick died, if Nick died, you wouldn't. You said you wouldn't climb. You feel like you wouldn't want to climb for three days, but if it actually happened, it'd probably be more like a week. And that's how you said that. <laughs> you said those words to him. I, yeah. I couldn't even rock climb for a week. Yeah, yeah. that's if Nick so. Died, He'd That's so to, sad. He had to hold yeah. off for at least a week. Yeah, we talked about so. it. That would suck for him. I was kidding when I brought all this up. Now I feel bad. <laughs> yeah, it was one week. Yeah, well, Day at least, eight, I'm back at in, least honestly. When, at least when the call-ins happened, none of you were killed off. I did so, ask a lot more people true. who they'd kill off, and it was a lot of AIDS. Overwhelmingly. A lot of AIDS. That's okay. You asked that live at the venue? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Tween, fucking look up from your slop. <laughs> Look it up with slop up. coming yeah. out of your which, which uh -huh. member, yeah Ludwig which member big slop Ludwig yeah. big sloppy getting big fucked sloppy. at the Genesis venue come a flowing come a flowing come a flowing that's what I did in the in the spirit of Grant McDonald of course yeah. okay well, yeah no no look uh, I I think it, it, all jokes aside we we would all be devastated uh, but yeah <laughs> <laughs> why is that funny. Why is that funny? Dude. Yeah, no, <laughs> what? sorry. Why is that sorry. Funny? Yes. <laughs> He's this right. This is the first time I've ever been genuinely confused about why <laughs> someone's <laughs> laughing. Anybody got, a, anybody got juice for the primo? <laughs> Any primo juice? We're not pre, we're we are, did you I see he's memeing, right? Yeah. Oh, so, what, we're at 90. He's memeing. Are we? Dude, we're at oh. 90. Oh, I, I, I heard I meant so cuz we talked about doing the primo tomorrow already. Dude, pre like a teaser, like we always do. Oh, that was your shitty teaser. <laughs> oh, your oh, shitty little I'm teaser. I'm asking you if you guys have any oh, have any juice. Your shitty little bait teaser bait. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's why people. That's why people. If they wish that one of us was to perish from this earth, of the four of us, it'd be you. Oh. All right. Here, here is he. Here is the. Here's what we're gonna do. Tell me the tea, sweet sister wife. <clears throat> if we have. How many Patreons do we have right now? We have like a little over, over 20,000. 20, What's the exact? I want to see this, the exact number, uh, Zipper. 2597. Because if we record zero five, like zero. next Monday at exactly this time and we have two zero. Pitch him in the 212. What's a good number? 20300 patrons. What does that mean? What are if you we have exactly about? two twenty thousand three hundred patrons next week. No, no, no. You're incentivizing people to unsubscribe. Yes, if it's <laughs> we make enough. <laughs> we do. What do you? I always say and that, I, and I'm satisfied. Social I experiment. Say that. If you have exactly twenty thousand three hundred, then <laughs> I just want you to know, know that that's what you're saying. That's all right. Okay. I, fuck if I care. I right. Then I will give one random patron a hundred dollars. <gasps> wow. That's crazy. If we grow less than usual this week. <laughs> yeah. What a what a wow, shit. That was shit. Let, me, let me understand. That was great, man. Let me understand. So if we lose money, you'll lose more money. <laughs> yeah. Got it. That's okay. Right. We're all wow. on the same page. You guys still want more? Is that what you guys Come want? Come join the Patreon. Let's join make more Patreon. money, guys. Look, you, we're fine. It, what do you mean? We have we're a there. bonus episode every week. <laughs> yeah. It's gonna be we're yeah. gonna do it. There's gonna be a bonus episode if you want to listen yeah. another hour. We need, we need more money. <laughs> Funneled in. Uh yeah, and we went to Genesis, so we're behind on the advice show and the decom show, so we gotta double that up. Well, and business. we're not fulfilling and give us more money. <laughs> the fuck up. Yeah, let's do both. Uh final word, final word. Uh, uh the you know, Saikuno. Uh huh. You've heard of him. Yeah. <laughs> he uh he posted a picture of the his sleeping arrangement for Coachella, it's Coachella that. Valley, and it's a closet. Yeah. And I looked at that and I said, we "Holy shit, are the same. We're the same." And this whole time, when I meet him, it's gonna be electric. It's gonna be fireworks. And I on, and on that note, I'm gonna go be on. so smooth and greasy for you, Saikuno. And 
on that note, see you guys in the Patreon. Thanks episodes. for watching the yard. Thanks for watching the yard. Sorry, Goodbye now. Sorry, he exists. <laughs> so shit. he found out about this serial killer that used to eat kids, but he would eat their butts first. <laughs> 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 for sure, for sure. No, that's right. Dude, Nick <laughs> just <laughs> ejectiled his water. Killer, this is true. This is true. This really happened. And he would talk. Uh, he would. He would write shit. He would. He would write with. He would cook and eat these kids. And he. Would